YouTube, welcome. <laughs> it starts with, hey, I think your nose is great. Thank you so much. I assume you remember the bit of when Ellie told everyone that someone made fun of me for my nose that made me self-conscious. Um, we have so many people. Ellie Beatmaker, again, thank you for the raid. My boy, my boy raided me, and we've got all of uh, his beautiful chat here. So yeah, hello, YouTube. You get a proper greeting. Um, yeah, all right, let's get started. <laughs> Excuse me. Onions. I don't think I've ever said hi to YouTube before. Yeah, well, you, hey, you're here now. You got to. And Wilson cursing immediately. Pretty sure that gets me demonetized immediately, right off the bat. Thank you so much. It's not like I was making money anyway. It's all good. Let's get started with chapter four. Um, so, okay, we've done chapters one through three. I thought we got every collectible. Oh, I thought. I'm pretty sure we did. I think it just glitched. Because I'm pretty sure we got every collectible. But anyway, let's just continue. I don't feel like doing all that crap right now. I don't feel like it. We always do the collectibles at the end anyway. Let's turn off the music real quick. I also, I don't know if I mentioned this before. I found out that VOD does get to hear the music. So it's not like they're totally just lost as to what's happening. They do actually get to know like the jokes that I do where I just play random music in the middle of stream. So we're good. Wilson demonization, de de demonetization expert. Yeah. And demonization as well. Bro is like straight from hell. Thank you everyone for being here. Um, uh, normally after a raid, people just dip, and I have the 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 luck of people tending to stay after a raid and actually hanging out, and I appreciate it. I love it. It's it's so kind of you guys, and um, I don't even know what to say. After I hit 300 uh, followers, I was just like, holy crap! I can't believe that this is working. Like to some extent, <laughs> fuck you, Ari. Yeah, fuck you, Wilson. To some extent, like. This is just working more than I ever thought it would. It's all on this USB drive. All the evidence you need to nail Typhon for Gabe's Typhon death. Typhon is a company caused Gabe's death, our brother, after an explosion. We stole a USB drive from a woman who works there. We stole a USB drive from her. We decrypted it. Now we're trying to take down Typhon. One final reminder to head over to the lace flower cart and grab a rose before they're gone. This, this, the world building in this game is amazing. You guys should watch the old VODs if you get a chance. Stock and birthing age would offer up roses in order to attract a mate. What can I say? History is weird. Thankfully, we've lost the mating stuff. The person speaking right now on the radio, we're trying to fuck her. Just so you know. A rose is a great way to say you care. And an even better way to say, hey look, a rose. Stroke, what's up? Sounds fun. What's good? Is giving away a rose something I'd do? Maybe. I can decide downstairs. Ellie thinks the main character looks like one of our For friends, now, Silver Lichen. I'll grab the USB stick. Alright, let's get the USB stick. There's just a bunch of Chinese takeout. Beautiful, beautiful. Love it. I think I'll stick with Minesweeper from Where now Where is the USB stick? I'm thinking this will make an excellent after-festival snack. I... Okay, I want to see what's in the chest. Holy shit, you're right, Ellie. Okay, so apparently we all agree that she does in fact look like our friend. Oh well. For now, I'll grab the USB stick. Where? Uh, also, yeah, this is a psychic ability. I can like look into people's brains and shit. Where is the USB stick? Where? Where are you? Also, we can look at our phone, which is cool. So, like, normally a bunch of stuff happens in between chapters. So, there's some commotion by the Silver Dragon. Everything is so not fine. Oh. Um, last, last episode, uh, Charlotte kind of went crazy and broke some crap in her shop. In her, um, weed shop. So, um, yeah. Yeah, that's fun. Um, okay, we don't need to go through all the text right now. Ethan... Oh, is Ethan the kid? Ethan's the kid. Okay. Enjoy the Spring Festival. I wish I could be there, but at least I'm getting crazy good work done on the next Daynor comic. Sweet, what's happening in this issue? No spoilers! But- well, hang on, should I do a voice? Should I, should I do a- should I try to do a kid's voice? No spoilers! But Daynor finds a gate to the underworld and fights the King of Demons! Oh snap, that actually seems like a pretty big spoiler. That's the first page! Hello? Alright, so that's what I sound like as a kid. <laughs> Yo, where's this USB stick? Hang on. We gotta find this crap. Uh... 
I thought it would be... Okay, it's not around here. And I just gotta make sure it's not like somewhere... Ooh! Okay, if it has a little dot there, that means I can look at the memory behind the, um... The thing. you give roses to your crush at the spring festival, so... I've never had a girl give me flowers before. I'm sorry. I didn't know you cared so much about traditional gender roles. I'll get back to my butter churning and doilies. <laughs> Shut up. So, um... Charlotte was... Gabe's fiance, or like they were dating, they were about to get married, and then Gabe died. And that's why Charlotte's kind of falling apart, because she blames it on her son. And she doesn't know how to feel, like she feels like a terrible mother for blaming it on her son. Okay. Achievement? Yeah, we- downstairs. If you didn't know, I'm a huge achievement hunter, that's how I play all my games. So, um... It, yeah, if you- if you like achievement hunting, um, just be aware. Please never do a kid's voice again. Scrub, thank you for the bits. Thank you so much, um... Uh, if you pay me more, I will do whatever you say. That's such a lie. <laughs> no amount of money is gonna make me listen to you. What the heck? Um, love you. Um, <laughs> uh, so yeah. So if you like achievement hunting, I know that it's it's like a very small community. Uh, from what I've seen, I've never seen anyone who likes it as much as I do. But there's so many people online that I know like it because True Achievements has like seven hundred thousand people on it. Um, that kid's voice sounds like you were getting electrocuted. Well, maybe he was. Uh, it was through the phone. Maybe the phone was electrocuting me. Um, Ari, can you play that arcade game? We actually did last chapter. I can go back and play it if we get a chance. Um, whenever I get an intermission, I'm I'm down. I'll try to play it again. Does this work to prevent a kid's voice? All right, for five minutes, I'm not allowed to do the kid's voice. Hype train is close again. Jesus Christ. Um, Jesus. I tried to say Jesus Christ and also Jesus, guys, and it. Um. All right, I gotta set a five minute timer. Check. 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 Oh, <laughs> Scrub, thank you for the bits. Ellie, thank you for the bits. Holy do the kid's shit. voice. You Hang on. Okay, I can't do the kid's voice because someone just paid me channel points to not do it. And I think that overrides... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Um, But thank you guys for the bits. Bert? Ellie, thank you for the bits. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hey, guys. Money Happy or loyalty, choose princess. one. I choose loyalty. Thanks. The the girl on the right is the one. Or, yeah, that girl Don't is the one we're trying to have sex with. Once he sees what's on that stick, it's over for Typhon. Hence, the celebration. <laughs> <laughs> I think we've all earned the right to enjoy ourselves a little tonight. Ellie, I can do the kid's the voice when I see a kid, bro. You'd better be front and center. Um, um, who's playing? Nice. Who's playing? Local band. Uh, this is the Spring Festival. I don't really know what the fuck is happening here. Like, this is not I something that they, the they talked much about in chapter be a normal three. Person for a while. Can't make any promises. I'm sure that something lore-wise is gonna develop now. But I think since we gave off the- I assume what just happened is we gave the USB to if Gabe. I to give away a rose, Steph and Ryan would definitely be Oh, also, list. Steph and Ryan, those two guys, anyway. are- they're our best Time friends. The they are also our two love interests. And I've been going for Steph. So I'm going to give Steph a rose. But, um, ooh, I can read all this. Um, yeah, so I assume that because we just gave over the USB, we're going to have to wait a bit for lore stuff to develop. So in that time, we're going to do normal stuff. Hydrate, guys. If you have water at home, drink some water. I paid money. Listen, man. Anyway, I'm Izzy. That's Steph. We're drugstore makeup from Seattle. We've got um, merch. Ban the ban in in-game action. Hang on, that's not in-game, Ellie. <laughs> do you do you understand how this works? <laughs> Count me in. I'm dying. Does your dog like me? That's so cool. Zenner is like, my dog has come to watch me and joining you. That is so cool. Does your dog like me? Does your dog think I'm cool? So then, where's the after party this okay. year? This is the saddest thing. Eleanor, that woman, she has dementia and it's like slowly developing. And she's not telling her daughter or granddaughter, I guess. And we're the only ones who know. I'm getting scammed channel points and money. You should use the channel points thing properly then. That's an L, bozo. After party? 
Come on. God. Young man they like just hope yourself. Riley is doing all right. What the hell oh, no. is. What happened Honestly, to Riley? I'm getting pretty bushed. I can have Colin in a night soon. Hi, Eleanor. Good evening, dear. Uh, where's Riley? Hey, so where's Riley? I haven't seen her around. That didn't get me, El Bozo. Um, Try again, boy. She's got a lot going on right now. I think she'd rather keep to herself tonight. Okay. Oh. That was odd. I wonder if there's something she's not telling me. <laughs> Mini dab, boys. I did it. Did it for you. The decorations really turned out beautifully. It must have been a huge amount of work. It's worth it. Do you know how many people have told me my animal normally doesn't like people, but they like you? Because that's happened, like, a solid couple of times. And it makes me so happy. You don't even get it. I love animals. I got really bored and made this. Hang on. What is that? Wait, you can do that? You can, like, change emotes? Wait, that's so cute. You made a pog emote with, like, <laughs> a little... That's so cool. I didn't even know you could do that with channel points. Um, Anogaf got taken by the creeper. Kind of got to gotta go take a quiz for my online class, but hopefully I'll be back later. Days, Sundays, thank you so much for being here. Um, good luck on your uh, quiz. Thank you so much. We drinking later? So, we doing shots tonight or what? Of course. Body shots. Who's going first? Steph. 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 Okay. Just kidding. Oh. <laughs> or am I? <laughs> I love Eleanor. She makes me so sad. I better get going. All right, the alarm went off. I can finally do the kid's voice again. Let's freaking go! <laughs> you too. I don't even remember what the kid's voice was. I'm not even gonna lie. All right, <laughs> oh, ban the kid's voice again. The five minute timer starts again. It happened last year. Yep, I remember it clear as day. Jed. It's been a hell of a month. 11 p.m. But this and he was already makes it all as a scum. Jed loves this town so much. It's inspiring. Like, if I put the first kid's voice in comparison to the second, there's no way it's the same thing, right? Because I don't, I don't remember what it was. Oh, I can take a rose. Let's take a rose. For Steph. Literally just one Fall Guys without you. Ellie, let's go! So proud of you. Uh, did you win in uh, Extreme or did you win in something else? I heard an alarm and thought it was my phone. My bad, sorry. Your kid's voice is just your voice? Oh, we gotta help this guy. No. This game is so the red one was 234. Why do I Wait. do this to myself? Hmm. Damn it. Maybe I can help him somehow. <sighs> another One, year, another two, prize three. gift card for yours truly to keep. I'm such a little devil. Really? Come on, jelly bean lady. That's not right. It's not the microwave again. It was my phone this hey time. There. Guess the exact number of jelly beans and win a prize. <laughs> Only one guess per person. The exact number? Is that how this game is supposed to work? <laughs> You can go right after this determined young man. We actually had a jelly bean counter at, at uh, campus. So the girl in front of me put her number. I just went up, wrote one above her number, and just went. I just left. <laughs> I put, I put. She put like 550. I put 551 and was like, all right, I'm done. Is there anything else I can get? Any other another information? Year, prize Doesn't look like it. Card for yours truly to keep. I'm such a little devil. The microwave needs to be a channel point redeem. What? Just, just... Is it just like a sound of a microwave going off? Because that's really funny. I might do that. This is impossible, right? Okay, but I want to help this guy. Let's talk to him real quick. Hi. Oh, hey. Nice to see you. You're taking this jelly bean thing very seriously. Yeah, because the prize is a $100 gift card. Chrissy's been all anxious ever since she got lost. So, Aww. I thought I could get her. Oh, this is treats, the guy I helped find his dog. Which is really embarrassing saying it out loud. Not at all. 
That's sweet. Maybe I can help. Oh, for real? Are you good at this? How many jelly beans do you think there are? Uh, uh, none of these are right. Probably 300-ish. 300 300-ish. 300 That's what I just said. We uh, on the same wavelength, my G. Yeah, could be. Feels like something just changed in that lady by the jar. Maybe I should read her. There we go. There it is. 300. What a nitwit. Not even close. I was that far off? Maybe I should say something before he guesses wrong. Also, the hell is your problem, lady? Hey, I've got another guess. Yeah? Let's say something super high, 700. I think it's closer to 700. Yeah, 700 feels right. But we have to get it exactly. Hey man, learn math. That is not 700. His heart skip a beat. I should read her again. J just so you know, that jar, there's no way it's 700. If it's 700, I'm. Hear me. They're really. Close Wait, to what? <laughs> what the heck? Who is this girl? Hell yes. Your secret's mine. Let's give him the answer. The answer is 731. Don't ask me how. 731 jelly beans. That's. That's correct. That's what you get, jelly bean lady. Yes. That's what you get. Thank you so much for your help. Sorry, you I got a little, got a little <laughs> agitated no there. Um, I, I'm gonna walk away. <laughs> I'm gonna walk away. Wait, what is she thinking right now? I want to know what she's thinking. I can't believe it. How did she know? I she am a god among men. Trauma. I'm really yelly today. <laughs> I, I don't think. Man, I came in here with a lot of energy after hanging out with Ellie. Like, <laughs> I don't know what it is about hanging out with Ellie. We just like bounce off each other so much. Um, Took a minute, but I dragged his ass back to dry land. Where is? broadcast live from the park. What you thinking about? It almost makes this it feel like a tiny Coachella. Is awesome. <laughs> Super favorite tiny. time of the year, by far. That kind of enthusiasm. Oh, there's the alarm. Especially for me. Yeah. Um, okay, I can officially do the kids for you guys. Yabba dabba yabba dabba do. Um, what do we want to do? Where's Steph? Um, wait, what are you doing? Oh, you are Steph. Hi, Steph. First, let's look at her. It's just awesome. Maybe I could give a rose to her. Let's talk to her. Hey, Steph. I love her. She's so cool. I can do so- God damn it! <laughs> okay, cool. Let's talk. Let's give her the rose. Let's do it! I'm not giving it to Ryan. Who wants that hunk of... sexy? <laughs> this is for you. Are you serious? Of course I am. Dude. Thank you so much. This totally makes my night. I'm glad. I hate love stories. They don't get to be happy. Hey, could we meet up after the show tonight? I actually have some pretty big news to share. She said mysteriously. <laughs> of course. Speaking of... She's got a Brian tattoo. Let's go. Minute. She's got a tattoo there? where I have a tattoo, bro. Sure. What the heck? That's cool. I love stuff. We twin in for real. Uh, we read some of this. Was there anything new? Uh, your stuff, your license expired. Everything's set. Meet me at the stage. On my way. All right, cool. We are starting. Eleanor. Um. Are you joining us this evening, dear? Or sorry. Are you joining us this evening, dear? Yes, this is one party I'm willing to brave. Uh, we'll make it pay this spot. How do you do an old person voice? The more the scrub spends, the less likely. That is exactly what I'm saying. Every time he spends money or spends channel points, he, he has less chance of using no cursing. And honestly, um, Jazz has had no cursing for literally ages and hasn't used it yet. Sounds like Ryan is ready for me. I better head back. Um, we need to go to stage, right? What's good? 
was good. It was poppin'. Diane? Two-faced bitch. Uh, hi, Alex. Wanted to wish you a wonderful first spring festival. Unfortunately, I have to work through it this year, but I really appreciate our conversation earlier today. It was great getting to know you better. Thanks, Diane. The feeling's mutual. Smiley face. So here's the thing. She's the woman who works at the company, and she kind of tried to, like, stop the explosion so that Gabe wouldn't die, but she also kind of didn't. So it's like, it's like, eh, you know? Like, she was getting threatened low-key, but at the same time, it's like, eh, she's lying to us, and she's the reason our brother's dead. So, hey. And our brother okay. was the sweetest guy in the world. Just in time. He was so nice. So, who's playing? Yours truly. Seriously? That's awesome! Well, wait, who else? Steph. Who else is playing? I hate you both. <laughs> we didn't want you to wuss out. I love that. I mean, I don't know what she expected. No shit she's playing. Absolutely would wuss. Wussing out is highly underrated. We haven't even practiced yet. Who cares? Everyone's wasted anyway. Just play whatever. I'll follow your lead. I don't think this, this is actually awesome. going to show up on Trust stream. Me. The transition was so good, right? And I, have to, I loved it. That was so funny. Um, we've never played together before. and uh, I might have to play music myself because I think it might be... um. Anyway... Sorry if this sucks. It might be DMCA. That was a little bit predictable. Yeah, but it was funny. I loved it. Fuck it. Don't know how they're doing this with a guitar and a drum set, but they are. We need more. We, we need more. We need more. There we go. That's better. Almost thought Heat Wave came up. I do not have the money to pay for Heat Wave, man. <laughs> Louder? <laughs> Chill. You. I'm gonna blow out your eardrums. I just love how if if I like hang on <laughs> if I have nothing this is <laughs> this is what you are watching oh guys I the kids voice is back the kids voice is back anyway <laughs> um that's yeah listen this game's great there's a huge problem with this one developer like this group of developers who are so adamant about playing music that's DMCA, but then not making an alternative that's good for stream. Like they always just play nothing, you know? It's just like, it's just nothing. It's just, it's just weird, but it is hilarious. I love it. I think it's so funny when you just watch people singing, but nothing's coming or people dancing, but there's nothing in the background. Oh shit, that's Charlotte, I think. Um. Yeah, she, last time we saw her, we could have taken all of her pain away. I chose not to. Um, oh, what's up, Daze? How did your quiz go? Yeah, we chose not to take her pain away because I decided that's too godly of me. Like, I'm not a god. I'm supposed to be a person. So we kind of left her to I potentially die, to you know? Her. Like, we left her very in a very bad really place. Weren't. Really? Then I fucked up because I was trying pretty hard to be horrible to you. <laughs> I was so excited about you coming to Haven. In my mind, the way I built it up, we were gonna be best friends. <laughs> she would have been my sister-in-law, assuming she and Gabe got married. I wish... I know. Me too. I don't even talk to her about, oh, I wish we, like, we can still be friends, because, like, obviously, the reason she's really sad is about Gabe. 
I can choose to leave, leave anytime I want, but I kind of want to see some of the cinematic. Because, like, th this game's beautiful because of its cinematography. If you were given a choice to remove cancer, you wouldn't do it because it's too godly? No! Because cancer isn't mental. I am literally fucking with her brain if I take away her pain. Gabe Newell, the owner of Steam? Yeah, that guy. Yeah, he's okay. the guy canonically in this game. And uh, canonically, he's dead. Sucks. But... Oh, you know. If you guys couldn't notice, my hair's been pissing me off the last couple streams. I'm gonna cut it on uh, Sunday. Which is why I was trying to get Ellie to stream uh, to record on Saturday, because I don't have face cam on our videos, in our Ari and Ellie videos. But when I record my video, I'm gonna have to have face cam, so we'll see what happens. I've seen some book, book characters take away pain and then something bad happens. That's what I'm saying, yeah. Um, I, I feel like it's just unfair to just totally take it. Um, hero, dude, thank you so much, you totally killed it. Award-winning bard material right there. Thanks, you were pretty amazing too, you know? Oh wait, oh wait, sorry, that's from the last chapter. Hey, come meet me on the rooftop! Sure thing! Cut it on stream? Bro, okay, here's the thing, I totally would, but my old barber is gone, he just disappeared off the fuck freaking fucking maps, it's not Ellie's stream anymore. Just disappeared off the fucking map, right? So, um, I have a new barber. So, if I get chill with him so and he's like, yo, really fuck it, let's do it, putting all that together. um, then... I guess Riley I'm down. Is feeling sentimental tonight, but I haven't seen her around. Riley's Where not doing she? well, I think, because she's about to leave for college. That's the thing. Someone actually won it this time. Yeah, I'm surprised. It's been what four years? I think five. Yeah, we got we got that win for Hector, okay. our boy. I gotta admit, this is a pretty great feeling. This is really cool. Um, yeah, okay, let's, Sounds let's, uh, let's keep moving. To meet me on the rooftop. I assume that's, that would be my rooftop. Black Lantern, we can also get in here and, uh, play the game. Play the, um, the, the little, the little, the little guy. Oops, sorry. Um, but yeah, so I, I, if I get chill with my barber and he's like, yo, let's just cut this on stream, like, for the lols. Maybe. Could be fun. I actually really want to do a cooking stream. We have... Here's the thing. I've been on a very... Um, love that you started talking about cutting hair while I was trimming trimming my stash. Um, I have a... I've, I've been in a very creative spurt in a for a couple weeks now. Um, and I've had a lot of ideas for streams and videos and things that I could do. And I am tempted to do some of them. Ugh. Not tonight. I was willing to clean them. Is there anything... Normally... In like some of these corners, there's like shit that I can look at, and um, yeah, I fucking called it. Come on, son, get it over with. <laughs> I, I don't want to get sick. You're gonna feel a whole lot better after you do. I'm, I'm gonna die, Dad. Not tonight, you're not, birthday boy. Although I suspect you're gonna wish you had tomorrow morning. <laughs> Aw. boy. Ryan got drunk for the first time. Oh, Ducky's here. What the heck? Let's uh, see how he's feeling. Sad. It's not the same without you, Tabitha. Never was. Never will be. Welcome Tabitha. back, Zenith. Sounds like Ducky's got a story to tell. Alright, let's talk hey, to Ducky. Ducky. Who's Tabitha? Aw. Do you want to talk about her? You know, Alex, on this particular matter, I don't have much to say. He's very formal. I was supposed to make cookies today. Oh, well, I guess I can't. Okay. I, I really want to make cookies on stream, or like brownies or anything. I actually have some cookies There's in my fridge right now. more I can do for Ducky. Okay, let's see if we can find something for Ducky. Uh, what can we do? What can we do that would make him feel a little better? What can we do? Oh, there's also arcade games here. Um... I don't think playing them is going to help him, though. What can we do for Ducky? Can we get him a special rum, maybe? Maybe that'll make him feel better? Or coffee? Um, yeah, the fancy bourbon. Jed bought this as a treat for the regulars. And okay, maybe himself, not that. I'm guessing. 
It was so fun watching Jed play the villain. What a good sport. Are you allergic to anything? Me? I'm not. <laughs> I'm very not. I have been looking into my friend's allergies because I want to cook when I um, when we all move in together um, next year. So, but like, that's like the only restrictions I have for cooking. Off. I'll take it. Imagine not being allergic to something. Yeah, it's great. That's why I can get tattoos easily. I don't need to like be careful and be like, oh, like what could they have in them? Because it's like, it is something that they warn you about. They're like, this well could played. make Kitchen you staff. feel sick. Odds are pretty good. I'm grabbing a cup later tonight. How do we help Ducky? Normally his drink is around here, but his drink isn't even here. Eleanor is like a mafia boss. Except instead of crime, she spreads flowers. I'm allergic to the most random stuff. Yeah, so is, so is, um, we give him shit for it. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, I think I gotta move on. Maybe I'll find something later. Wait, hang on. Um. Oh, I had to, like, get deep. Okay. Again, loud audio, uh, bright lights. Normally, it's not super bad, so if you, like, don't get affected too much, it should be okay. Just be aware that something might um, get, like, a little bit much for you. Especially if you're watching on a big screen. So right now, if you haven't seen this game before, basically he felt such strong emotions that we could tap into what he's feeling and see the world from his perspective. We did it once with Ethan, we've done it with a couple other people. Um, but yeah, right now he's really sad. We're gonna look into how he's feeling and see if we can help him. Okay. Tell me what I need to know to help him. Um, how much do haircuts cost over there? Uh, normally like 25. 20 to 25. You know, I carved that myself. Oh, hi, I'm Reginald McAllister III. My friends call me Ducky. <laughs> Tabitha Baker. No. Oh. Call me Tabs. I wonder how Ducky's gonna feel about us getting in his personal life. But I'm gonna feel much better helping him because he seems sweet. I don't know if he is. He might be in with all this Typhon stuff, but like... Wait, wait, don't drink it. Look at the bottom. What? What are you... Uh... Oh, Ducky, it's beautiful. Tabitha Baker. Will you marry me? 25, our barber does 40 to 45. Yeah, it's, it's, it's weird, man. Relatively, my haircut costs about 4 USD. That's crazy. I wish it was 4. It used to be 20. I think it's 25 now. Happy anniversary, love. Here's to Oh, I'm probably going to play something on the acres. jukebox to make him feel better. And another 30 festivals. If we can make it. Ducky. You're gonna outlast this whole damn town. I know that song. Poor Ducky. Maybe there's something I can do. What's the song, though? What's the song? Let's see if we can talk to Ducky. Normally, the next step is to talk to him. Yep. It's a tough night for you, isn't it? The spring fest? I do the haircuts myself, so does Ellie. Yeah, he's told me to maybe try. Um, let's talk about the wooden bear. Did you actually carve that wooden bear? Brana? <laughs> sure did. That was a long time ago. This trim and style I got was 15 USD? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know what it is with haircuts. I feel like they're different everywhere I go. Like, there is no solid, like... Spring festival must have been important I don't know. to you two. Indeed. We were married at the festival. We both loved it so much. You met Tabitha here, didn't you? In the lantern. I give my brother's haircuts and I have no experience You're so far. So he hasn't not liked it. Hey, you know what? Being here on that night was the luckiest I've ever been. Give me one sec. I 
I knew it. We were gonna play the song. I'm definitely gonna get copyright struck. Just saying. How did you? They're playing your song. Let's dance. A buzz cut super easy. I've done it twice and people gave me a lot of shit for it. People just know my hair as like, they know me for my hair a lot of the time because it's very like, it's very silky. Uh, if I don't keep a hat on all day, then it's generally pretty, um, pretty like voluminous. Internally screaming aw. Yeah, I know. This is so cute. I love it. This is so sweet. Just helping this guy finally get like... Just a little bit of happiness on the Spring Festival, which must be harsh from every you know year. What reminds me most of her right now? It's not the song or the festival. It's that you took the time to care about a sad old man for no other reason than to make the world a little less troublesome. That was Tabs. <sighs> Thank you, Alex. I think I'm a little more inclined to join the others outside. You're very welcome. Enjoy the festival. There's something about these kinds of games. Like this and Minecraft Story Mode, they just make you feel things. And I just love it. I cannot... I just love it. I've been playing- I've been playing this on stream, I've been playing Minecraft Story Mode off stream on my own, because it's also my, on my Xbox 360, which is at home, so I can't even stream it if I wanted to. So I've just been chilling and doing that on my own time, and, oh my god, I just... Man, those games just make you feel things, man. This is great. It's just beautiful. I love it. Oh, Strook, are you sick? I didn't notice, sorry. I hope you feel better soon. My sick body is warmed with joy. Yeah, it's great. I love it. It's just such a cool, like... Just a, such a cool way of world building. Just like... Oh, uh, we don't even get to play the game. Damn. Sorry, just W. I tried my best. Uh, you said you have some news? I'm leaving. I'm actually leaving Haven Springs. Can you believe it? Back on the road again. Fucking finally. Wait, seriously? I'm gonna play music again, Alex. Anywhere what I- What the want. heck? God, I forgot how fucking good it feels. <sighs> oh, but, I mean, I can't say this sucks. I gotta be like, I'm happy for you. Holy shit, Steph, that's so cool. I'm really happy for you. You better keep in touch. You think it's that easy to get rid of me? Come on, Chen. Can I come with her? Yo, she should invite me to go with her. I need a new destination. <sighs> You're my good luck charm. You have shit taste in good luck charms. <laughs> Shut up. Pick one. Um... Well, I don't want to go to the middle of the ocean. That sounds like shit. And why would I ever go to Massachusetts? Berlin, come on. Berlin. Fuck yeah. Bowie recorded Heroes in Berlin, and that record slaps. Where am I going to live there? Um, oh, a big loft, obviously. Some big loft with concrete floors and exposed brick That's walls. just where I'm living right I'll now. It's like it's not big. Escape. Writing lyrics in my leather-bound journal, and drinking absinthe straight from the bottle. Ugh. This feels straight Sunday, out of New Girl. They turn the place into a museum. Steph Gingrich recorded blah 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 here, and it slaps. <laughs> and I'm coming with you, right? That sounds like a pretty spectacular plan. Come Great. on. There it is. Called it. To Berlin? Sure. Why not? Doesn't have to be our first stop, but why are they day? knocking? Hang on, give me a sec. I still have friends in Seattle who book shows. Maybe we start there, or I don't know, Kansas City, Vegas. 
wherever we want. Look, I don't want to pressure you. Okay, I have my people over now. This is a guy with the with the viewers who I was talking about in Ellie's stream. To make sure other people get what they need. With the viewers. With the viewers, and this is my boy, my uh, dorm mate, I guess, housemate. Housemate. You need. How's the game? It's good. She just said she's about to leave, and then we were. Then she asked us to come with her. Obviously, I like you a lot. Alex. Hey yo, we got people. So do you know these people or not? Uh, I know some of them. Oh, some I mean, of them are. It's gonna sound so dumb with the stream, but. I mean, obviously we gotta kiss her. Clearly. Um. Oh, so do you make choices? Yeah, yeah. That's kind of this game. Kiss me. Kiss me. Kiss so me. So how does it work? Like, yo, is this like a, is like, is like Minecraft me, story mode? Like. Yeah, it's like Minecraft story. <laughs> that's exactly what I've been talking about on stream right now. All right, loud noises, bright lights. Y'all know the drill. <laughs> we got people here. Yeah, I just have people always show up in my stream randomly. Yeah, I got raided by one of my friends, so we got a bunch of, uh... What's his name? Ellie Beatmaker. My boy. Loki, I got download Twitch on my phone. Every time I pop into one of your streams, I'm always on my laptop <laughs> in the browser. Gotta get them notifications. Jesus Christ, the controller is shaking so much. What just happened? Wait, uh... You have an Elgato. Oh, no, you're just playing on the controller. No, no, I have an Elgato. Yeah, it's yeah, it's set up in the back. so much better than mine. <laughs> Oh yeah. Wait, where is it? I see it's that. like underneath the desk. It's literally just hanging. I, I made it very. It's like, dude. Days. My you wires are so up? fucked. My yeah. wires are not set up nice. Yeah, I'm gonna show you my setup. Though. The gay shines yeah, bright, right? I want to see your setup so bad. Like, like, dirty can you ask Advent if I can see a setup? You don't dirty have shit, to bro. decide. My little brother is like shit. upgrading his own okay. setup. Okay. <laughs> are his friends getting hyped over the setup, right? Think about it. Yeah, let's see the setup. So you're doing a dirty bulk? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, I'm up like 20 times. Nice, yo, that's actually, how long have you been walking? I'm gonna like head back down. I'm trying to remember my password. You phrased it in the best way, you really did. Oh, okay, cool, so, so, we're definitely going with her at the end of the story to Berlin. Or she's gonna die in this chapter or the next. Cause that's just how this game always goes. Damn, your chat's low-key active. Yeah, they're chill. Uh, it's yeah, it's because I was in Ellie's stream and then he raided me at the end of his stream. So everyone was just like, everyone knew that I was like, hyper oh, today. Yeah. Oh shit, we have the USB. I thought we gave that to Ryan. Okay, I guess not. So what happened in the story? Hey, <laughs> we don't bring up the dying what, possibility. What is your boy stream? Can I tell you something? What's up? What is your friend stream where the guy who raided you? He did Fall Guys today. Why you died? Wait, is your who's responsible? What's up? Isn't that Online crazy? Friend or? Oh uh, yeah, but like I've been friends with him for like six years. We're just fucking it siblings at this point. <laughs> because on the other side of all this, after Typhon, after you, it is. It's always just, cooking. It's so hot. Yeah, I mean, normal life. That, look at the poster. I was kind of. Oh yeah, they brought up. They put the that. puck punny back up. There was one stream where it wasn't up because Rishikesh had to I take it down. Wish you were here yeah, to see it. Yeah, his parents were coming. <laughs> All right, we had our little chat with Gabe. I wanted to get a neon sign. You and Ellie get along so well, though. Yeah, we've been friends for years, and, like, we've always just had the same humor. Like, we always just bounce off each other so well. It's great. That's why I love hanging out. Like, I, as soon as he asks, like, yo, Bishop and Ari, you want to hop in? I'm like, yeah, of course we want to hop in. Because Bishop, too, is just great. Like, Dude, Lucius is not as funny. You can also go check out Destiny's place right here. Alex. Wait, she, you said she plays Overwatch. Oh, she shit. Does. You speed drive? I don't think she wants I do. to come on the honest. Oh, we're talking to Pike about it. You sure? Gabe's call oh, she's their like, secret plan. Like, the cover up. No, nah, we chill too. I right, ask her. You yeah, need to come with me to the station. Down. He's on their fucking side. Of course he is. Alex? I was waiting for her to text me back. Don't make this hard. What's your chat saying? They're upset because the police officer is definitely not on our side right now. Oh shit! Okay, interesting. I mean, we should have known. Fuck the fucking cops, man. What the hell? <laughs> Dude, how loud can you be? Huh? Can you be like like yelling loud or not? Dude, I have yelled so many times. I'm surprised. I'm surprised Ashley didn't 
like <laughs> when I heard knocking, I was like, it must have been Ashley being like, yo, shut up. But she's she's chill. She doesn't I'm care. Chill. I was telling him that she's mad chill. Yeah, she doesn't care too much. And you guys are next door to her. Yeah. Well, Listen, how you pictured your first chat, spring festival, Twitch huh? Chat. Not exactly. I love my I I love my Twitch chat. I don't know if you can. <laughs> I can kind of see their names. You can't say this. <laughs> I had to delete that one, Strick. You can't say that. What did you say? Um, uh, okay, we're back. Again. We're back. Uh, coffee would be great. Sure. Let's just let's be cordial. Great. Thanks. I don't know why I offered. We're actually out. Dude, I can do. I can do yeah, that. literally do that, bro. Great. Bro, Pike. Here, bro. Why am I here? Not even joking, bro. Case. Not only are the hella chicks gonna be in my stream, as it's gonna be there. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> if you're loud, you get a restraining order. Dude, if we're loud, we can get like written up, uh, but yeah, Ashley's never cared. She, like, we have like, Yeah, okay, okay. <laughs> don't say anything. Oh, but yeah. wait, 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 wait. Do you have a WL chat or do you have a Poggers Omega LOL chat? WL. Alright, chat, how's everyone's days going, That's chat? Bullshit. We having a W or an L day today? W or L day, guys. Wrong. They're the criminals here. What's a Poggers? <laughs> we do have we have rat pog. pog we have rat pog it's, which is something uh, someone so someone made for me rat. he said pog it's been pog what's pog at least tell me you looked at it pog is good yeah pog is good pog, the bad pog is good at like omega oh, lols like omega oh, lols is like, like making fun of you it's like yeah what do you mean? Dude, my day has been meh like i'm that. sorry to hear that Why zen not? i hope he gets a little better well, or tomorrow will be better I would need a warrant. Right, what are your like top five games the case is closed. I well, I play for achievements, so my games switch yeah, out every day. But like oh. Cuphead, so obviously Sekiro, Celeste. The, I did what I could. Sekiro, but, it's like a, I have not. I've heard of it. It's made by the same people who made Elder. Uh, Sorry, Elder Alex. Game. Ooh, dude, she has that's um, Souls that's guys. um. I don't even Souls have that. Like, what's what's the name of them? The uh, fucking. The yeah, I don't even have that, bro. Yeah, this was like fifteen bucks. Really? Yeah. All right, in the stand. Huh? In the stand. Yeah, the stand. stand everything. Yeah. Wow, yeah. That's tough. Right here. It doesn't oh, I remember having matter. that webcam or tripod thing. Pike's getting paid off by the fucking mob right now. This is bullshit. Look, what happened to my brother wasn't an accident. It was criminal. Are you playing with the headset on or the what? Yeah. On that drive it's prove going it. through here. Oh, okay, okay. That's I love the wave. Could yeah, how much that might cost? It's like 200, I think. Yeah. Bro, I've been the using the same mic since fifth grade, bro. You I stole had Typhon's property. I used a uh, blue snowball for literally like eight years, I think. Yeah, I had a blue, snow I had a blue snowball back home. Yeah, it's good. I mean, I had the blue snowball ice, which is even worse. Okay, Yo, get that's the point. I'm right? sorry I stole back. the drive, oh, but... Apologizing Yo, hurry, isn't the enough. Alright, yes, chat. <laughs> Alex, See, like, ask I, I gotta put on my like... Yeah, ask if any of them even know. I don't think they do, bro, because they don't... You have like a completely different community, bro. Uh, Chad, guys, does anybody recognize me? Does anyone know this guy? He apparently has like a fuck ton of viewers. He's <laughs> not a fuck ton of right. viewers, bro. I get well, like a decent amount. I don't know this fool. Bro said, I don't know this fool. <laughs> <laughs> alright, alright, alright. All right. No, no, no. They don't even know who I am. Like, I'm, not, I'm not gonna cloud chase, bro. I'm not gonna cloud chase. <laughs> Wait, is this okay? To my nine viewers. <laughs> I'm not cloud chasing. Chad, I'm not cloud chasing. I swear to God. He said, no offense. She said. I don't think I've seen you. He said it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I did it, bro. <laughs> All right, enjoy his stream, guys. All right, I'll be in the chat. All right, chat. Take See you guys care, in the chat. Care. Enjoy. Have See a good time. Thank you for Yo, my bad for bothering you, bro. <laughs> no worries, no worries. People come in here all the time. Huh? Thanks for like this. Oh, always, dude. Take care. All right, guys. Let's get back in. I I love college. College is great. Those guys are really nice. Um, I don't hang out with I the one guy I literally met in the hallways today. The other guy who doesn't stream, he's uh, I've known him for a while, like since we moved in. He's super nice. I don't hang out with him too much, but he's like super chill. With computer fraud. All right, let's get back into this. That's a federal crime, Alex. Five to ten, easy. Fuck Diane. You know what? Fuck Diane. This isn't justice. This, isn't justice. this, is, a this is a joke. Joke. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I don't think you can do that to a police officer, but like, that's what I'm saying. It's not that bad. <laughs> hey, I talked to her, and despite how angry she is at everything you did, she's willing to let it I'm go. I'm not willing to let it go, though. My brother is dead. I think it's bullshit. This is bullshit. If you agree to drop everything, 
Typhon won't press any charges. Doesn't... Why the deal? Why would she do that? She just wants this whole thing to go away. This is how to make that happen. This is idiotic. We're gonna probably have to Fuck sign that. and then go and do it ourselves or some anything. shit. Alex. No. The paper Titan physics were nice. Something in the mountains. Something so massive they ignored Gabe's call and set off the blast just to cover it up. Don't you want to know what it is? What do you mean, cover it up? Another blast, unannounced, set off at the exact same time at the old mining site. And all of it happened just a few weeks before inspections were set to begin. Come on, Pike. It's all right here. Come on, man. Work with me. We like know he's human. Man. Like, this is a small town Alex, cop. Please, just sign the form. And we can both go back to the party. He's a small time cop. He's no. not like Alex, this is fucking not an offer that you Oh can my choose. god. No. no is not an option. He's not angry because he's not red. What are you so scared of? Purple's fear. See for yourself. Shit. What could be in that envelope? Typhon mining security threat evaluation. Alexandra Chen. Intel shows subject has a high level of determination of an efficacy. Um, I, they're following me? They're investigating me. And they're investigating Ryan. And Steph. Oh shit. Is this a threat? What did you expect? Huh? The Typhon, a global organization with billions in revenue, an army of lawyers, and who knows how many politicians in their pockets would just what, throw up their hands and say, you got us. I thought I could get justice for Gabe. Yeah, well. Typhon has their own idea of justice. Okay, so like I said, he's a small town cop. He's not like a bad person. He's human. He's just, um, he's scared for our lives. What game is this? It's Life is Strange True Believe Colors. Me, it's amazing. Nothing more than to make these fuckers pay. I'm having a lot of fun with this. I've learned the hard way that it's not possible. They're too big. Too connected, too ruthless. Fucking you what do we do, bro? If you want, call me a coward. But I don't want to lose you like we lost Gabe. I don't know if it's on Steam. I play it on Xbox Game Pass. Typhon. I bet if I took his fear away. See, okay. But it's not just about me. Steph and Ryan. Are That's the thing. Again, we can't take it away now just to help our own deeds. Fuck. I want to hurt Typhon so bad. But can I really put their lives at risk? I'm not going to do it. Again, if I'm not going to take the anger away, I can't take the fear away just to help me. Hang on, I will tell you in just a second, Varmint. Okay, we've got a big decision, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to recap you real quick what's happening. This girl, this woman, uh, Alex Chen, has... I hear screaming. Um... Uh, Advit, thank you for the follow. This is this is the guy who just walked in. Um, so okay, basically what's happening, right? This woman has psychic powers. She can see into people's like feelings and and stuff like that, right? And um, her she she comes to a small town after getting out of like foster care or whatever. And her older brother, who has, who she hasn't seen in years, greets her. He's the nicest person in the world. He takes care of her. He gives her a house. He gives her everything. And then. His son, or his, like, girlfriend's son, I guess, runs off into- <laughs> Why are you calling him a weird person? That's crazy. Um, runs off into the mines, into the woods, or whatever, into the mines, right? And, um, and so explosions go off while we're trying to save the son, and Gabe dies in the explosions. So now we've been exploring, we've been stealing shit, we've been trying to figure out what Typhon had to do with the explosion, because there was something off about it. And now we're um yeah 
we're at risk because Typhon's pissed because we because they definitely did something um but yeah we definitely cannot take away his fear because we didn't take away her anger it is totally selfish if we do it so we have to sign the affidavit and then we'll just sign. figure something out after we'll just figure some other way to get to them <clears throat> Spot. We we weren't gonna be a whole team of lawyers anyway. Now. Time to sign my soul away. Ah, <sighs> damn it. Listen, there's a whole chapter left. There's no chance this is the end, but like, god damn, this sucks. I wanna read him. Can I read him? I can't even read him. Fuck me. Hereby referred to as a releaser, agrees to drop all charges against Alex Chen. Um, charges to be dropped, computer fraud, theft, and we must cease and defe de de desist. Great, cool. Useless. Absolute pieces of shite. We're God, so we could try. We cannot be God. That's the whole point. He did the right thing. We're trying to be better. We're trying to be human. I think that's an interesting theme in this story is that we can't just take away people's fear and anger like that. They have to live their emotions, you know? And and listen, it screwed us over, but I think I feel better about staying by my morals. Which is always the interesting thing about this game. Like, I'm sure some streamers would have uh, risked taking his fear away and they could have changed the game completely like that, you know? Like... Who knows what would have happened? So, um... I don't know. The part where we can take down a company? Oh, yeah. We could just take down the company after we sign. I think we could do it. Easy. We got a whole chapter to do it. That's like two and a half hours. You know what? Let's do it. Let's do a little poll real quick, right? Let's just do a little, a little, a little poll. I want to see... Would you guys rather... I stream chapter 5 on Friday, which is tomorrow, or Saturday. It's going to be at 9 p.m. like always. Wait, I can't do Saturday. Okay, I guess we'll do, we'll, we'll try for Sunday. So yeah, would you guys rather I do it on Friday or Sunday? I'll just start that poll just so we know. Because... I think you guys, if you guys are enjoying this, you'll want to see chapter 5, and I want to do that soon. Uh, Jed, come see me when you get a chance. Okay, we'll have to go see Jed. Damn. Can't believe we have to sign. I shall get my TNT. Yeah, we just blow up Typhon. Literally a billion dollar industry and, like, I company. I believe this. I had them. How did it go so wrong? Sorry if you guys hear no background noise. My roommate's do doing something and I don't know what. I'm gonna fix my webcam. talking to Jed will help me feel better. I just moved it so that he wouldn't be in the shot. I don't think he likes being in the shot mostly. First, I need to get out of this dress. If it's so big that they're willing to drop charges, I bet there's a lot of mail. Blackmail we could get. Yeah, so that's the thing, right? Um like we could blackmail them, but we don't have evidence anymore. And we signed a document saying we signed a cease and desist. We agreed that we would cease and desist. That's the problem. Um, uh, this was a nice little thing of hey, thank you for coming. I'm glad Ducky had a nice night. Ducky had a nice he night. He deserves it. It was special for me too, Steph. Enjoy that ice cream. Uh, Steph, I finally grew up here and told a very special girl how special she is. And the scariest part wasn't telling her. I was realizing how dumb I was for waiting this long. Aww. Oh, we can get one scoop from Am Avalanche Ice Cream. We should go there. Um, I assume that might be where Jed, Jed is. Oh, we also get to see people's emotions. Like, there's stronger emotions. Like, sadness from Ducky. Steph has joy. Pike has fear. Um, I'm not gonna uh, read all that right now. Because I really don't feel like reading. Uh, she wanted to change out of her clothes. Let's do that real quick. If I can destroy Ellie's economic community with girl Ellie with one posing, do the Might same with a company of millions. Alright, let's go see Jed, I guess. Let's play the game first, because you guys wanted to see that. Here we go. Um, we played this once before. Maybe we can beat Gabe's uh, old score of 6140. It's like Pac-Man. 
but mine edition. Oh crap. Leave me alone? Thank you. Okay. I see how it is. Where are you going? Oh, you're chasing me, huh? Alright. Go up. This is not good! Okay, we got this. Easy. If I can get that battery down there. Uh, where are you going? Oh yeah, you go there, you idiot. You freaking idiot. There we go. See, now this flashlight kills the ghost. So yeah, this is literally the full game. It's really cool. I love it. There we go. Alex sounds depressed. I wonder why. It's like Donkey Kong mixed with Pac-Man. Yeah, it's great. I really like this. It's like just a cute little game. But the problem is that Gabe's always going to have a better score than me. Because I'm probably not going to spend this much time trying to beat a score. If we can just uh, kill that guy. And run through all this. My Wi-Fi is being horrible right now. It's a good thing we're not doing anything story related. We're literally just playing a freaking pixel game. I bet there's an achievement for it. I've actually checked there isn't. Trust me, before I start games, I check. Oh, crap. Okay. Before I start games, I always check if there's achievements that I should be getting. Because a lot of the time, they'll have achievements that I just don't want to do. And I'm like literally, like, I would rather just not play the game than have to leave an achievement like that. The only time I leave achievements now is if they're discontinued. Like on Xbox 360, there's a ton of games that are, like, that have discontinued achievements. Um... Which sucks. It It's so painful knowing that I'll never get to them. We're doing so well right now. Gamer moment. I love this. We're doing really good. Oh crap. Why'd you spawn on me? That's not fair. That it's not bloody fair. How do I get to that now? What the heck? Uh, okay, let's just move on. I don't- I don't know how to get that last one. Let's see if we can take both of these guys out real quick. Yep, yep, there we go. Here we go. Can I jump this? Oh, I can! Idiot! I could've done that ages ago. I didn't realize there was fall damage, God damn it! It's alright, let's just get out of here. I don't know if I get any lives back. I don't think I do. What if Ari actually gets the high score though? Dude, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's get the high score. There might be an achievement for it. Who knows? I actually, okay. I did check. Oh, thank you for going down. I was almost so trapped. There was fall damage. I'm an idiot. I don't know why I keep doing it. I'm actually gonna throw away the high score because I just forget there's fall damage. Where are you going? Are you going up? No, okay. Uh, don't do that now. Uh, freaking pepino! Crap! I literally just threw it away. This is not good. You can go back and replay certain uh, certain uh, chapters or certain parts in this game, so you might be able to save Gab or like get certain achievements. Okay, so <laughs> I assume you mean Gabe. Uh, Gabe will never come back. He dies in every playthrough. Why'd you go up? No way. No way! I got caught on the ladder. That sucks. Okay. Well, hey, listen. We did our we did our game for the stream. Next stream, we'll try again. We'll get this win. Easy. Did we even get on the... We didn't even get on the board. Jesus. These kids are good at this game. Okay. Anyway, let's move on. Um, What was I saying? I was saying... um, Yeah, okay. So you'll never go back and save Gabe. That's just how it works. You just never can. Um, But... For the, um, for getting, like, uh, the, the collectibles and things, we already do that at the end of every stream. Um, we always get, uh, because, like, my whole thing is I want to see you guys, I want you guys to see me 100% the game for once. Because generally I just do it off stream because it's, like, boring. Hey, but it's easier for this game. So I was just like, there let's just, is. uh, you know. Have a seat. So, yeah, 
you guys will see me 100% in the game, so we'll we'll get the chapter four collectibles Something today. Me you've had a more exciting spring festival than you planned for. Yeah, yeah, we did. You saw Pike arrest me. And let you go, apparently. Then there's that business with Ryan and Steph earlier today. I wasn't sure why it took all three of you to work out Diane's lunch order. I know you're used to looking out for yourself. Gabe was like that. But Haven's a community. We help each other. I want to help you. But first, you have to let me know what's going on. Jed is like the dad character, so like obviously I'm going to let him know. I mean, he's been so sweet. Okay. What have I got to lose? Oh, I don't even get a choice. Cool. <laughs> Take a shot. We're gonna take a shot. You help each other except for when you don't. Even Diane wanted to help us, I think. She just, um... You know. Okay. Typhon killed Gabe. Typhon threatened Ryan. Which one do we want to do first? Let's do Typhon killed Gabe, obviously. Because I don't think... Typhon did, killed Gabe. Did they threaten Ryan? I don't remember. I have proof. What proof? Everyone can tell that Jed is the dad character, I stole right? It from Diane. Emails and documents proving there was a second explosion the night Gabe died. To cover something up, Jed. Some secret they buried. I wonder if it's related to my psychic powers, but I don't think so. I'm pretty sure she had this before she came to this town. I don't even know what to do next. Unless she has history here that I didn't realize. Not ever. I mean, legally, you have to give up. Legally, you cannot keep going. I get it, but, like... Are you really gonna poke hiding. the bear? Oh, shit. Didn't expect that. Not gonna lie. Wait. You're telling me you knew that Typhon's crooked? This whole time? I'm gonna have to go back and watch the VODs. Trust me, it's such... It's worth the watch. I'm not even saying that because it's my vibes. I just love this game. Runs this town. I think this game's amazing. I've been carrying their secrets for far too long. I know what they buried in the mountains. Tell me. I'll do one better. I'll show, I'll you. show you. Guessed it, baby. We be illegal boys. Yeah. This is this is an interesting end to the chapter. I assume we're getting no close to the end, but like. This is interesting. I was not expecting that. I thought he would help. I didn't realize that he'd help this much. Was that an Avengers Infinity there, War reference? <laughs> what? Which part? Where are we? This is such a cool game, isn't it? Nowhere. I love it. About I've been having so much fun. Ways, the mining site where you search for Ethan. Five clicks that way is town. I'll do you one better. I yeah, Infinity Roy reference, hundred percent. Ventilation shaft. They're scattered everywhere. Remember when Only Avengers invented English? Mines, creating a labyrinth under Haven. What you're searching for is down below. Wait, this is sus. Wait, this is sus. What if he kills us? What if he takes us out right now? What if he's evil? No! I was scared? right! God damn it! I was right. I'm sorry, kid. Put the gun down. Okay. Just put the gun down. I tried to talk you out of it, scare you off. I was sure those pictures of Ryan and Steph would do the trick. God but damn it! You were relentless. Won't leave damn well enough alone. You don't have to do this. I do. Twelve years ago, 
I made a mistake. Jump into the hole. That's what I'm saying. Jump into the hole. The kind of thing that you, you can't undo. This chapter is so hectic, dude. The Typhon made me a deal. A way to save my town. Give my boy a normal life. If this chapter ends on a motherfucking gunshot, I swear to God. Y'all know how it is. Loud audio. Go to hell. Ah! What the fuck? The kind you can't undo. Complete chapter four. It did end on a gunshot. I have been calling it this entire stream. Every single fucking. Oh my God. Okay. So, I was in the minority for convincing Pike, uh, letting Pike convince us to sign the affidavit. Okay. Okay, let's move on. Obviously in the majority for giving Steph the rose, who wouldn't? I didn't sit at the bonfire, didn't know that was a thing I could do. I also didn't sit on the couch, didn't know that was a thing I could do. Okay. Um, I could have not met Alex on the rooftop, that's crazy. Oh, okay, as in, because Ryan would have met me. Um, we shared a kiss, obviously. Who wouldn't? Um, everybody who went to the rooftop almost always kissed. You make me want to play this game? Listen, I'm not even sponsored. It's just a good game. Like, I don't even know. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see, let's see. Let's see what you're saying right now. What if he intentionally shot her in a way where she won't die? Or even he, he missed intentionally and she fell back because of the shock. We saw blood splatter from the shoulder. So he definitely shot her here. This game's free on Xbox Game Pass. That's what I'm playing on right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. The, the screaming internally but calm outside is strong. Yeah, I am going crazy in my mind. Um, holy shit. Um, Charlotte felt weirdly detached for some people. Interesting. I helped the jelly bean counter. Uh, I didn't find Riley at the bus stop. Oh! Oh, I didn't know I could do that. That's shit. If you download this game, there's also another game from these people called Tell Me Why. I definitely don't think it's as good as this. I'm going to I'm going to be completely honest with you. I think this has hit me so much harder. But um yeah, we hit the minority for getting Tucky to go to a festival, which is nice. I'm sad I didn't see Riley. I wish I did. Um uh we didn't talk to the diner buyer. I didn't know that. I didn't really read that my blog post. I was rushing through. Um, and then there was guy and gal friends who didn't admit their feelings to each other. Okay, interesting. Again, there's a lot of world building in this that I just miss. Holy shit! That's fucking crazy. I got Tommy Y for free on Steam. And Xbox, and Xbox during game on, so I have that for sure. It's, yeah... It's not, like, the best, but it's pretty good. Okay, let's- okay. Do we- okay, do we want- Here's the thing, I'm willing to do the next chapter. Do you guys want to see me just hop into the next chapter, or do you want a small break to do the collectibles? It is totally up to you! What are you guys feeling? Also, what won the poll? I didn't even see. Did you guys see what won the poll? Because I was not watching. Friday one? Okay. Okay, so tomorrow we'll stream chapter 5 if we want, but we can also just stream it now because we have time. You know what? Fuck it. Let's just do it. Let's just do it now. Um, I need to piss. I've been drinking so much water. Guys, give me literally two minutes. We're gonna run. Hang on. Uh, YouTube, I'll be right back for you guys. You guys get to pause and see it in just a second. I'll be right back. Okay, okay. We're gonna roll right back into it. Let's go. Let's go. Also, guys, uh, my pronouns are they, them, just so you know. I've just been seeing in chat, and I know that you guys are um, largely from LA stream tonight, so uh, you might not know, but just letting you know. <sighs> I gotta get up at 5. Listen, fuck the sleep. We gotta... 
We gotta get this. We gotta get this. We gotta figure out this story, Come man. Back, Alex. Oh my god, this is a therapist you from the beginning. Your time in Colorado? From the beginning of the story. This is the therapist from the beginning of the story. Let's start with something positive. What did you learn from your visit to Haven Springs? Uh, the meaning of home. I thought I learned what it means to make a place your home. That must have felt like quite the victory. Let's talk about how it feels to know that you might have been wrong. Oh, sorry, my control is on the desk and it just vibrates so hard. It actually scared me the noise that it made. I should stop leaving my controller on the desk. I'm proud of you for trying. You helped some people. Chased a mystery. Got to kiss a pretty girl. But Alex, you're right back where you started. You're wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong. I don't belong in here. If that were true, Alex, you'd know you were talking to an empty chair. If you're on Xbox, how are you streaming? I have an Elgato, so I have it hooked up to my PC, and I stream from that. That's why everyone was freaking what out about my setup fuck? earlier. Oh shit. Yo, we're in the mirror dimension or some shit, what the fuck? Are those faces me? Yup. Is that what I look like? Really? Hey, my guitar. Knock, knock. I mean, let me knock, obviously. Um, Alex Chen? My guitar case has never heard of me. Sure. Huh. Huh. That's what I said. <laughs> my dog is sat next to me the whole time after coming into my room after joining your stream. That's so cool. I'm really glad your dog is enjoying my stream. Alright, well, let's see if we can open it. Oh, bright lights. Of course. Okay. Can't get out just yet. Bright lights again. I, I just disclaimer for generally this entire uh, scene. It's gonna be pretty bad, I think. I guess that's me. Case number five three three two two. Okay, so we got a number for the gu guitar case. But let's let's explore a little more before we go into that. Emotional instability, occasional violent outbursts, hallucinations, visual hallucinations. Um, I can't read that. Oral, delusional ideation, depression, anxiety. Diagnosis: no fucking clue. Coming down a what? Alex experiences a detailed and robust delusion that she's able to read other people's emotion states, emotional states, and believes that because of this ability, she's uniquely equi equipped to help others overcome their own emotional trauma. It's difficult to overlook the irony. Someone as profoundly dysfunctional as Alex adopting the role of emotional caretaker. Had she not been returned to my care, I do not think it would be hyperbol hyperbolic to speculate that her reckless attempts at fixing her friends and family would eventually have gotten someone hurt. It's my belief that Alex's delusions consist... consist Cons constitute, sorry, a threat to her continued well-being as well as those of others. As such, I recommend Alex be thrown down in endless pit, her body shattered against each jutting board and errant brick until she's forgotten in the darkness beneath the world. That is, in my professional opinion, the most humane thing we can do for her. Damn, English is hard. English is hard, man. See, you know it's fake because she didn't need to rewind it.
Fucking amazing start to this chapter, by the way. What the heck? What the heck? Guys, if you haven't seen the other VODs, I have a playlist on my- on Ari's streams, like the- or Ari's VOD archive, it's currently fall, called. Don't belong to Dr. Lin. Trust me, you should watch them. This story is dark and interesting and crazy. A tuning peg. Uh, I mean, let's take them back. They're ours. I'm gonna assume the tuning peg is gonna help with the guitar when I open that up. Yep. My phone also went off. Interesting. Are there VODs on YouTube? Yeah, I have a YouTube channel called Ari's VOD Archive. It's um, it's pinned in one of my Discord channels. I think you can also do exclamation point. If you scroll down under the stream, I have all the commands there. Um, you should be able to get to the VOD Archive from there. Um, and yeah, it's got all of the um, all of the things. Five, three, three, two. Thank you, Rook. Five, three, three. Two, two. Love that noise, by the way. What the heck? I knew you would probably forget. Listen, man. I had it. I had it. It's okay. Alright, well, let's fix it. This time I'm not even gonna play music when we play it because I think it's even better for her to just be silent. Bright lights again. Oh, we heard it this time. Damn. Oh. That is such a good cut, by the way. This game has such good cinematography. I say it so much. There's so many- Like, they've got the humorous ones like they had last chapter with the cut to her on stage. Funny as fuck. But then they've got shit like that. That just is- Oh my god. And the loading times aren't even that bad. They don't ruin the story. That's because that's not a song? Yeah, I don't think it's supposed to be a song. Did she get caught by something? Oh. He intend- I'm willing to bet he intentionally shot her arm knowing she'd probably live. I honestly don't know. She's lucky as hell if she's alive right now, man. That's not good. So that's gonna kill her, right? Probably. There's no way a guy like that, Jed wouldn't have gone for the head if he really wanted her dead. That was some bars. You just spit some fucking bars there, man. Yeah, no, I agree. There's no way he, he would have, uh, they were point blank. If he really wanted to kill her, he would have shot her in the head. That being said, like, I, I, <laughs> everything rhymes with this man's name. And with dead and Jed and said and all of that stuff. Um, it's, it's hard to Alex. tell. We should not be seeing Gabe right now. He's dead. Gabe? <sighs> You're dead. That's exactly the reaction I just so, had, so... Lots of people are dead, Alex. Most people. That's not uh, a lie, but, you know. I want to say... a hospital? Dr. Mendez to intensive care. I haven't Dr. eaten Mendez dinner yet, so I'm gonna have some care. snacks. Yep, definitely a hospital. Gabe. Okay, here's what I do know. You are 10, I am 14. Our mother is sick, so is our father. But it's a different kind of sickness. 
play your part? I think we know that their father was abusive or turned abusive. Ow! Gabe, why? I didn't do anything. Stop. Both of you. Dad. Behave. Alex, go check on your mother. Okay. She was right over there, waiting for me. Mom's keys. Gabe, Alex. I need you to listen very Achievement, carefully. Achievement, let's go! <laughs> Sorry. We've got some scary news today. And I'm going to be spending some time at the hospital. What? Mom? Are you okay? Hush now. It's going to be okay. Do you understand me? Things will be... different for a little while. But I am going to be okay. I was gonna say there's no one, but then I realized there's a curtain off section. That's exactly what I was thinking too. Like literally, I was just like... Is Alex Chinese or part Chinese? I honestly don't know if they refer to her like ethnicity or history that much. Her or Gabe's. I don't think they talk about it. I might be wrong. They might have, like, back in chapter one. But it's been a while. Like, it's been a minute. His spirit's down in that mind. That actually makes sense. Because... that Yeah, that does make sense. Alright, let's talk to her. Loud audio, bright lights. You know how it goes. Hi, Mom. 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 Such a brave girl. How do you ever get so brave? Is that how it went? You don't think you missed anything? I can't do this, man. This is so sad. She's 10, by the way, in this. Ow! Gabe, why? I didn't do anything. Stop. Both of you. Dad. Behave. What if she was found and taken to a hospital? I don't think she was found. I think she's passed out in the mine right now. She's alive. She's just passed out down there. Alex. Go check on your mother. Okay. Gabe is- this isn't a time loop. I think Gabe is trying to get us to remember properly what's happening. Gabe from the afterlife, or maybe he's just a figment of our imagination, I don't know. But he's trying to help us. Wait. Did I miss something? We we had a cut there when we were talking to the mom. And there's something important there that he wants us to see, I think. And dumb mom, I mean our mom. Hi mom. <laughs> the mom, yeah, I know. <coughs> Maybe he's just trying to get us to see our repressed memories or something. I don't know. Mom. <coughs> water, Alex. Get her some water. <coughs> get her some water, man. It's right there. Let's go. A little sippy cup of water. Oh, what if the water was poisoned? Loud, bright. Careful. Disclaimer. What if the water was poisoned? We didn't pour it ourselves. I'm just suspicious of everything now. Thank you. Who knows what's a conspiracy? Maybe this has all been happening since our birth. They were always planning to kill Gabe. You almost never cried. 
even when you were very small. Did you know that? That's been my biggest challenge with you. How do you take care of someone? I gotta go do something else. HSW, thank you for dropping by. Good luck with whatever you're getting done. Appreciate a lot. I appreciate all of you for being here. I've never, like, this has been so engaging. Like, everyone's been having so much fun watching the story. And it's been, it's been great living through it with you guys. So thank you so much for being here. And for all the love and support. Maybe she's been in a coma all her life and this is all a dream. I think that's what they wanted us to believe in the beginning when we dreamt our therapist. No fears, my strong girl. I want you to make me a promise. Your brother. Your father. They are going to need you. <laughs> Maybe her mom is evil the entire time. And never died like Squid Game? Spoiler, but it's been out for so long. We would do that, Alex. We've never seen this before. I don't think. Must be important if we were given it. Such a brave girl. Ever get so brave? I never watched Squid Game. What a spoiler! Yeah, it really says nothing about the show, considering there's nothing to do with moms or anything. Could that have saved her from the bullet? Straight out of manifest. What the heck? Oh, by the way, Manifest Season 4 coming tomorrow. Part 1, I think. Very exciting. My family has all loved Manifest. Whoa! That is such a cool transition in. What the heck? I am such a huge fan of that. Alex has power, so maybe she can super heal or something. She definitely can't. I'm gonna be honest. Um, it didn't look like she was bleeding from her shoulder. It's possible the fucking amulet saved her somehow. Um, but trust me, like, I- If- if she survived because of her powers, I'm gonna be a little pissed. Because that feels like the, a cheap, like, cop-out. In my opinion. Unless they do it very well. We'll see what happens. But they've been pretty good about having a good story so far. So I actually think that they'll have a reasonable explanation for her, um... For her survival. Is this her childhood home? Before everything kind of fell apart? Damn. I really like the art style for the photographs. Because it's, it's clearly like not supposed to look exactly like them. It's not supposed to be like photorealistic. It's just a nice style of having drawn photographs. Was that the last time you talked to her? Mom. I... I think so. Do you miss her? Gabe. What's going on? Gabe is so meta. Yeah, he's breaking through the fourth wall, bro. You're 11. I'm almost 15. Dad and I are time bombs. You keep running back and forth trying to defuse us both. This uh, is going to suck so bad. Yeah, Chinese with dragons are more represented in the Chinese culture more than any other Asian countries. I honestly Funny wouldn't part. know, but yeah, I guess maybe they are. Gabe keeps saying play your part. I think clearly the whole point is like we're reliving scenes from our childhood. We're learning more about Alex and Gabe's childhood. And 
Gabe wants us to learn something. I think he's trying to piece together something for us. Maybe maybe it's his real ghost. Maybe it's just a figment figment of our imagination. Because I think his real ghost is um, further away from where we are falling right now. I'm pretty sure his ghost is at the other bomb site. Um, there was only ever one thing to do when they got like this. You could put headphones into record players. Really? Here's another thing of where you can't hear the audio, but I think playing stream beats right now, it's like, it's it hits much more hard when it's just silent. We can't hear it, but it's a DMCA, yeah. Modern record players would have headphone jacks. I think the point is though that they're younger, like this is older. This is like normal record players, I think. Alex? Hey. It's okay, it's just me. But you know that's not how it went down, right? Oh, we're like going through our repressed memories, I think. It's interesting to tell because from the beginning, Alex has been, I think she was in rehab or something. She had a rough childhood. So it's hard to tell what's real, if any of it's real, like what's happening with her, you know? I think it is real. I don't think she's like crazy or anything. I'm sure there's um, an achievement somewhere around here. So real quick, I'm just gonna explore. I'm gonna see if there's anything I can uh, I can look at. Can't go up there. Okay. Anything in here? Anything? There it is. Knew there'd be something. Hey, Gabe. I'm Leslie Halloran. I'm from the Oregon State Child Protective Services. We got a call from someone who said there might have been some kind of fight here last night. Is your dad home? Oh, gosh. You know what? We were... Yeah, that, that was like, uh, rehearsal. And I'm in this play at school, and my dad, like, he was, um, helping me learn my lines. Must be some play. But if you need anything, my number is on there. Okay? Had to reload the stream. Um, yeah, we just found a business card. We did a little memory of, I guess, Child Protective Services coming in. Where are you going? Are you gonna tell her? Or is that my job? Keep your voice down. Fine, I'll do it. Alex, dad lost his job again. So we're broke again. Don't talk to me that way. <laughs> Despite what you may believe, you do not know everything. You think what? He's 15 at this off? point. It's okay. We'll figure it out. I could, um... I don't know, Dad. But what are we supposed to do now? We gotta eat. We can sell some records. Or or what about my guitar? We can sell that? Alex, what is it gonna take to get you to stop defending him? If your mother could see you now. I don't want to hear about Mom. Babe! <laughs> I'm so tired of you using her as an excuse to be a piece of shit. <laughs> don't fucking touch me! Piece of shit! Dad. <gasps> Damn it, Alex! I'm okay. It's okay. It was an accident. Alex, I... I, I, I didn't... Dad! Dad, it's okay. Really. This I'm is, not hurt. This is too real, man. The voice acting is amazing, this. and... Mr. Chen has an amazing fucking voice actor Dad. behind him. That was no fucking accident. Well, it was an accident to hit Alex. He was gonna hit Gabe is the thing. Someone will come. 
that woman from CPS. Someone. That's the woman we heard about in the business card. Dad. I'm sorry. No. Uh, no. It shouldn't have happened in the first place? No, of course not. <sighs> Holy fuck, though. This is so rough. What the fuck? That hits so hard. Just like Gabe is trying Gabe is like obviously angry after his mother's death. And I get where he's coming from. I also get where the dad's coming from in terms of like not knowing how to hold a job and like keep his family going alone with two kids. Obviously you shouldn't be hitting anyone. But like they're both just loose cannons. And that's why Alex was forced to be the mediator. And that's why so much of this shit's repressed. That's what we are digging through right now is all of her repressed memories. We are unlocking them and forcing her to relive them right now. That's what's happening. Where's that trauma warning? I gave you guys a warning at the beginning of the stream. I was like, this is a dark game. This hey, game gets really dark. Question? Which orphanage is this? The one in Grant Park? Kind of thought it'd be nicer. I can't do this okay i i can't you need to no you need to be honest about what you see i was i have and now i'm done almost but not yet you are 12 i am 16 i steal a car and end up in juvie gabe Come on. Then you're 13, 14, 15. Orphanages, group homes, musty rooms in the strange houses of foster parents. By the time you're 17, you, you've seen them all. Somewhere along the line, you start to feel things. Your own emotions don't belong to you. That's why she's an empath, because she was always taking care of no her one. dad and Gabe. Alone. Oh my god. I told you this was like a trauma response at the beginning Alex. of this game. Play your part. In chapter fucking one, I'm pretty sure I told y'all that this was all a trauma response most likely. And, or at least it had to do with trauma, and it was, like, related to it. Ah, oh my god. This game, man. This game's crazy. Alright, let's, let's look at this. I don't understand. Why can't I have my guitar? We've been over this, Alex. Your guitar stays in the rec room. You can play it during free time. That's bullshit! I don't need it in the fucking rec room! I need it when I'm stuck in the fucking dorms! Alex, that's enough. Maybe we'll just take away your guitar privileges entirely, if that's what you prefer. You can't do that! I mean, it is her guitar. That's... Fuck, I do want to see what this graffiti is about. I remember the kid who put this here. Sadie... Sally. Uh... Something with an S? What if her glasses she limit her power? First, right? I think her glasses just first. make sure she sees people. Then I freaked out on her and she was done with me. Just like everyone else. Alright, let's play our part. Fuck, dude. 
This game's devastating. All right, let's go. Oh, I didn't realize I could move. Whoops. She's been through so much. I just don't know if we're prepared for a troubled girl. It says here she's sensitive. What does that mean? I feel like we don't see enough of the realities of foster homes. I think this is like so important to I wonder why she's never found a home before. <sighs> they can just look through the window and watch some creepy. I mean, listen, I assume some of this is exaggerated for the point I'm of storytelling. Sure she's a sweet girl, this is like coming from her mind, remember it's not real. For us. She's awfully old, isn't she? This is the kid that's been in all those fights, right? I want to help. I, I really do, but there's just something oh. broken, wrong with her. She was just called old? Yeah, I mean, when you're 17, whoa, that was fucking sick. When you're 17, it's kind of as old for foster parents. They want, like, babies, you know? So they can, like, raise them to be what they want. They're not going to pick up, like, a hurt 17-year-old girl. Which is just the reality of foster situations, or, like, orphanages and all that stuff. That's why... That's probably why this game is making us delve into this. To I'm sorry. open people up to that concept. That's why the system's so shitty. Why? You need to see it. See what? That nobody picked me? Nobody picked you. Nobody picked you. Nobody wanted you. Mom died. Dad left. I bailed. You couldn't keep us together. It was my job to keep us- You were 11 years old. You were 11 years old. You were a kid, Alex. Let it go. People leave. Life gets hard. Sometimes it's a big shit sandwich. We don't know what she's talking to. It, it could just be in her mind. Gabe's spirit, be angry at Dad. who knows. Miss Mom. Hell, be angry at me. But don't give up. No one gets to tell you what you're worth. And no one can take your life away. Fight. I'm not sure I... You have a gift. It's something you don't even understand. You can change the world. Make it better. Now get up. What? Get up and fight. Switching back to reality. Oop, there goes gravity. Oop, there goes gravity. Maybe she deals with her trauma and emotions by imagining people from her life like this. Uh, yeah, maybe. There's the back to reality. I did it a little early. I could tell that's where we were going, and I just... <laughs> I wanted to do the bit. It's possible she imagined Gabe. It's possible he actually showed up in her mind. We don't know. That's kind of the point. The point is it's supposed to be psychedelic, kind of. Because it's, um... Because it was all in her mind. Like, she was passed out on the floor. We were just seeing what she was thinking. Now, I'd really like to know why she's still alive.
first things first, she should find something to cover up her shot wound. Yeah, I mean... I'm not, I'm gonna be honest, she didn't even, like, try to check it. I think she has too many injuries, injuries to care. But you can, you can see the blood splatter, like, on the shoulder there, on the left side. This game has movie logic, that's how she survived that. I mean, yeah, she's got plot armor. Can't kill her or the game's over. I wish there was a real reason, like, oh, she had something on her or something that allowed her to survive. That would be cool. But, um... I'll take it, whatever, she's alive, we keep moving. We all know at some way she would have survived regardless, like, just for the story. That's the interesting about thing about stories, it's like... How much suspension of disbelief are you willing to put into the game? And I'm willing to put a lot, because it's a fucking psychic, like... Like, nothing about her is real. And who knows, maybe they'll come up with something later. We don't know. I've got to find a way out of here. Uh, worst thing about... Alright, Ohm. Okay. Worst thing about stories... It sucks because I was already reading chat, so it didn't totally get me. Worst thing about stories is, in my opinion, is that you know they'll never kill the main character midway through. That's the thing, right? There's really no way to get around that. Like, no matter what, you gotta keep the main character going. Or there's no point in, in, in watching the... Or in, like, no there's no point in the story. Not that I'd be much good at climbing. Like, what are you gonna do? There's really nothing you can do. Damn it, you're in a cave and everything. Hey, try again, man. Maybe next time. Lines growing into lines. Just like Jed said. Maybe the fall was an optical illusion. Maybe it was not as far as it looked. Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised. It, it Like, she might have vertigo and it made it look worse. They definitely use, like, a fisheye kind of lens. I mean, it wasn't a real lens, I'm but, like... choose not to read anything into this. That's what they tried to do, you know? Poor rat. My boy. I... I honestly have no worries for the main character, but I have so much worry for the side character. That's the thing, right? I told you that Gabe was gonna die, and then he died. Cause that's just how it goes. How long has this stuff been down here? Oh yeah, this is the old mine, isn't it? What if I manage to make a story so good where I can kill off the main character midway through? Go for it, man. Nothing's stopping you, other than, you know, the whole trying to make a good story with one of the core elements being killed off immediately or like midway through i mean they did it with diver uh di what's the di divergent divergent that's the word i was i was i kept thinking diversion um oh, no. No, no 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 come on no 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 you have like you have like four matches left don't you seeing a little something she's probably trying to preserve them okay. though that's something no spoilers for divergent dude it's been out for literally years it's been out for so long i'm not gonna say anything though i won't say anything else read it read it now is the only lead i've got i always feel bad like mentioning media but like a big part of streaming is media, and um, I try to mention stuff that's not new, but like, when something's been out for that long, I mean, but yes, I won't say anything else. Listen, just read it one day. Oh, right, boy, Trust, I liked close. it. I might reread it soon. Eldavers for life, huh, Jed? Dig so deep, we see where the devil sleeps. Goddamn right. This is it. This is what Typhon tried to bury. A lot of runoff moisture in this soil. Jed, we gotta call it. This dig is fucked. Nothing's fucked! Jed, we got no pumps running. No, my teams have never quit a dig this deep before. We finish the job. What if they're looking for a body right now? Steady probably goes. not. They probably haven't Steady. noticed yet. 
fuck was... Move! Come on! Clear the tunnel! It's red. Is there Who's angry spirits in there? Jed. Who knows? Fuck! Jed. Maybe people are angry at Jed, Jed for what he did. We gotta move! Now! His greed led to... There's still men back there. A lot of deaths. They'll drown! Yeah, and so will we if we don't get the fuck out! Make the call, Jed! God damn it! God damn it! Everyone, let's go! Now! <coughs> it smells like fireworks. Must be where Typhon blew the charges. What the fuck is that? That's a physical manifestation, it looks like, of... Unless, oh, it might be a physical thing that has emotions behind it, like a memory, as we've been seeing. The issue is that she's in a mine, so no matter what, she can't really tend to her wounds. Holy shit. It's the, it's the locket. I didn't even need to look for that one. Jed! Come back! Jed, you son of a bitch! Jed, you gotta stop, man. Jed! Fuck you, Jed! Come back! Her dad managed. It's over, Jen. He's not coming back. He came all the way I'm here. Sorry. I'm so sorry. And we just managed to find. Oh my god. That's crazy. Jed has to do with Dad's death and Gabe's. I mean, he didn't really do anything with Gabe's death, but he's the reason for her dad's death. Holy shit. I'm also now realizing Alex is totally alone. Her dad is confirmed dead. Gabe is dead. Her mom's dead. Like, god damn, that's crazy. Okay, first of all, where the fuck did she go to get out of there? There were- there- what? She just gets out that easy? That's what I'm saying! Interesting. I mean, I assume she walked. She just walked. I mean, she was good enough to walk. But whatever. We raised our drinks to Jed Lucan, who had this location on December 30th. Something, something. Pulled some people out of hell, I think. How can she even still walk, bro? I have no clue. Listen, I don't know how she's walking, but I will say that was a, the coolest start to a season, to a chapter that we've seen so far. All of the internal conflict, the unlocking of repressed memories, the finally seeing her backstory, just, it got so real. And the voice acting, by the way, fucking amazing. Mr. Chen, whoever they cast, absolutely brilliant. If, she, if this was a real life stick, she'd either already be dead or she'd be passed out from the blood. I wonder if she goes to a hospital, what would she tell them? And yeah. during my time here, I've come to realize what makes Haven so special. It's a flower shop run by multiple generations. A bar owner who greets every customer by name. It's a spring festival tradition going back a hundred years. History, loyalty, pride. These values which define Haven are the same values that Typhon was built on. 
Fuck you. And that you. is why our partnership has been so successful. It's been my privilege to renew Typhon's commitment. To I hope she comes in all beat up. We believe in this community and we're tremendously excited for its future. Thank Fuck you, you. Diane. Diane. I think I speak for all of us. When I say we're they really ma to managed make to make us official. go from oh Jed is like so, a die character to I want Jed dead. Yeah. And then lunch. They th there there she is walking in all beat up. That's what you get, you son of a bitch. Ryan, help. Come on, Ryan. And Ow. Steph. Oh my god, I'm fine. You are not fine. We have to get you to a doctor. What happened to you? Well, we have to tell them. We have to tell I them now. Something you need to hear. I'm sorry. What? Oh shit. Ryan's dad is Alex, Jed. I totally forgot. Hurt? I was so quick to attack Jed. We can call an Typhon's been lying to all of you. And so has Jed Lucan. Alex, what's going on? Don't even. Fuck you. Fuck you. What the hell happened? I was down in the mine last night. I saw what Typhon's been hiding for 12 years. Alex, thank you for the raid. We are at the end of the story. The story We're so close to the lie. end. Welcome, guys. Jed caused the accident. And then he abandoned seven of his men. He let them drown to save himself. There were pictures of me and Gabe down there in the dirt. Because one of those miners was my father. He's gonna make her seem crazy. He is. Typhon wanted to keep this covered up in case it jeopardized the vote. They're ruthless. All they care about is making more money. They'll do whatever it takes to push this expansion through. So they decided to bury the evidence and nothing was going to stop that blast. Not even the fact that there were four people up in the mountains. I swear if they go the cliche route, I'm gonna be so pissed. That's how Gabe was killed. They're gonna go the cliche route. <laughs> Jed knew all along. He covered up the truth about the past, about Gabe. And when I found out, as you can see, he tried to kill me too. Remember in the beginning when Gabe was like, be honest with people? Maybe if we had been honest throughout the whole playthrough, people would believe us immediately. I don't know what's going to happen here. Why aren't any of you saying anything? We don't want to embarrass you, Alex. Diane, you bitch. I wasn't asking you. I fucking hate Diane so much. The things you've said obligate me to at least address them. These accusations are... Jed, you bitch, too. Well, Fuck you, Jed. Insane. And trying to go into the mine was obviously a very dangerous, very illegal thing to do. But we all sympathize with your situation. You've been through so much. Steph and Ryan have to have my back. Family, and maybe Eleanor? But Eleanor's, like, got dementia. I don't know if she remembers all that. For his loss. Something to give you comfort and make your life seem less unfair why don't you just tell the truth you've been planning your exit from typhon anyway what you never signed up for threats or attempted murder you hate this <laughs> now's your chance to stop we know that she has a conscience do you have any idea what Alex is talking about? No. I don't. I've tried to be there for Alex since Gabe died. I thought... 
I don't know. I, I hoped I could be something of a father figure to her. All I can guess is sometimes. Yes, the main character is named Alex. The people we lash out at are the ones who were trying to help. Oh my god. You're lying. This is an act. You're lying. Please. I know this is hard to accept. You all trust him. I did too. But I'm telling the truth. This is so frustrating. I believe you. Of course I do. Thank you, Steph. Ryan, please. Ryan, please. I believe you too. Let's go, Charlotte. Oh my god. I'm horrified and shocked and still processing everything, but I believe you. Ducky? Ducky, come on, that's what I'm saying, Struck. Miss Harmon, please remember the terms of your settlement. Screw your settlement. I would never take that money. Let's go, Charlotte. That's what we like to hear. I would like to speak. Come on, Ducky. This young lady came to Haven as a stranger. But over the last few weeks, she's become one of us. I took care of you, my man. Now, her story certainly seems unlikely, if not impossible. That's fair. But she deserves at least an investigation of her claims. That's what we're saying. We ought to take her seriously. That's right, Pike. You know the truth. Pike knows. I agree with Ducky. I've always found Alex to be a very trustworthy person. That's what I'm saying. This is what I love to see. She wouldn't make these accusations lightly. Something must have happened. Also, I'm definitely passing out at the end of the scene. Wait, I'm telling you right no now. actual evidence of anything. Maybe not. But that's what I think. Yeah, Diane. Get fucked. She's definitely passing out at the end of the scene. A hundred percent. She has to. Otherwise, these injuries mean nothing. I mean... I heard you out last night. You know the deal. <coughs> You're a cop. Do something. Alex, just... Just give it up. Pike, you fucking rat. You fucking coward. coward. That's what I'm saying, Alex. Let's go. <laughs> On the same goddamn wavelength. That's how you know they're... Writing is amazing. Ryan hasn't said anything yet. I'm really sorry. I'm not gonna ask him if he believes me. Why are you doing this? Come on. My dad is not a murderer. Come on, Boy Scout. What the fuck, man? Were you afraid we couldn't get Typhon? Is that why you need someone else to blame? I'm sure a lot of it is affected by my together. past choices. For Gabe. Here's the warnings. Ryan. No. I'm not going to let you do that to me anymore. Ryan. What the hell? I know he's your dad, but look at her. Why would she lie about this? It's going too far. Alex almost died. It's not true. Fuck you, Ryan. After everything? Seriously, fuck you. Stop. What the fuck is happening right now? Motherfucker said stop. 
she really just said stop and then the world turned to like they just put a different tint on this entire goddamn world she's definitely gonna pass out yeah i know why you tried to kill me it's not what you tell yourself that you thought it was best for haven this was never about haven at all was it this was about you I know it's easier not having to think about the men you buried. <laughs> she went, you're done. <laughs> you want to look away and pretend the people you hurt aren't people. But I won't let you. My father worked for you. His name was John. He was a victim. The world never gave a shit about him. He was always struggling just In my to get opinion. By. I'm not saying he was right to hit his kids, obviously. I still hoped one day things would be better. But I do like to see the good in people. But you killed And him. How, how much he fought. And then Gabe. My big brother. He was building a family. He was building a family here. Doing it his own way. Figuring it out as he went along. He was so nervous about it. And so excited. And he brought me here to be part of that family. But he died. Because of you. And then there's me. For so many years, I just wanted to survive to get through. Haven changed me. I started to think about the future. I don't think she wants to help people. I might genuinely lie and say I missed my alarm last night and not go to school. Are you serious because of this stream? I want to belong. I want to belong somewhere. I want to know that there's a place and a group of people who wouldn't be the same without me. I was starting to feel that here. Special lighting equals weird other dimension? Yeah, I think so. And you tried to murder me. It's hard to tell. You would have ended my life just so you wouldn't have to face the truth. Damn. Good god damn. You've forgotten it. Haven't you? You've plastered over it with another story. What's crazy is Om and I were out super late last night. So we're I'm tired as fuck too. <laughs> that you're that you're a hero. He thinks he's a hero. You tell yourself. You're a hero. A strong leader. Sometimes that means making hard choices. Decisions that could lead to people dying. Out of life you sight, out of mind. That. For real. Haven's lucky to have you. But that's the lie. You scrape it away. What do we see? You're a coward and you're also selfish. Eleven years ago, you led a group of men to their deaths. And you were too selfish to say those words out loud. There was so much to lose. The love of your wife. The respect of your son comfort and ease you had walking around the world are we brain blasting him right now are we actually like putting oh, our spirit in his mind like what is happening lives. from an outside perspective i can feel you trying to pull away don't this do be a brain blast that's what i'm saying the truth hurts sometimes it's so awful you think you're gonna break 
But when you come out the other side and you're whole and free and still alive, then you'll finally know how strong you really are. I see the truth about you. We're checkmating his you reality for real. You hate what you did in the past. You hate what you've done to keep it secret. And the more you deny that hatred, the worse it grows. They probably put more budget into story writing than the game's looks. I think the game's looks games look amazing. Parts of you. Looks amazing. I do not forgive you for shit. I don't need to forgive you. And I condemn you. I condemn him because I don't fucking forgive him. How do you forgive someone like that? Bullshit. I don't think you need to forgive sh like people for that shit. I want to see the condemn slash forgive stats. I do too. I feel like I'm in the majority. Drastically. The game looks good, but I think the story writing has more work on it. I, I, I think so. We had an animator for this game in one of my streams. I don't remember which one it was. It might have been like the second or third. Maybe it was the first. I don't remember. It was actually, actually, I think it was the first. Because I'm pretty sure I streamed it and he was like, uh, they, whoever the animator was, was like, yo, I can't believe someone's still playing this game. But it was very cool to see them. Don't blame the weed. There was a sticker. That's cool. And the news is still coming in on the Titan mining scandal that has rocked the western slope town of Haven Springs, where a council meeting was the scene for shocking revelations. Local bar owner and council president Jed Lucan admitted in a tearful confession to covering up the death of seven Titan employees as their manager 12 years ago. A recent cover-up, which involved a clandestine and unpermitted explosion to the board inspections, caused the death of Haven local Gabe Chen last month. Mr. Lucan is currently in police custody, awaiting arraignment. This is wrapping up. We'll have plenty more about this developing story, including the resignation of Titan CEO, the market impact, and what it all means for your drive time commute coming right. She is a. F she should be a baseball player. What the fuck was that, man? <coughs> yeah, the silence is worse. I need to get some air. Oh my god. You're summoning all my Sorry, wait, let's strength, let her talk. Power. I'm now ready to move from the bed to the rooftop. Okay. Did we win? I mean, I don't know, man. Oh, we've got a lot of text to go through. Holy shit. Jessica? Who the fuck is Jessica? Oh. This is yet Hello, Alex. This is Jessica Martinez from the Rocky Mountain Gazette. I'm sorry to contact you out of blue. I know you've been through a lot. We're working on a story about the Typhoon controversy, and I'd love to speak with you, either on or off the record, about your experiences. I'm not really comfortable talking about it right now. Your comfort would be my priority. Please contact me at this number if you change your mind. Thank you for your time, and stay safe. Thank you. Fucking piece of shit. Um, Alex, please pick up. Just let us know you're okay as soon as you can. I'm pretty sure you just lost your phone, but Ryan's freaking out. Okay, we're both freaking out. We just want to make sure you're safe. Call us? Alex? Okay, so this was like the morning that I... You know. Uh, Arthur. Alex Arthur Jones with the New York Telegram. We want your story in our ongoing Typhoon coverage. When's a good time to speak on the phone? Sorry, I'm not doing any media right now. I'm getting a lot of requests. When did you learn that your father lived in Hammond Springs and worked with Jed Lucan? How did it feel to learn that Jed Lucan was responsible for the mining accident that killed your father? Why do you think Jed Lucan confessed to his crimes? And then we blocked him. Because, obviously. Ethan. Um, 
Uh, ta -ta -ta -ta. Oh, wait, this is so cute. Wait, hang on. Dad knows what's up. That's awesome, Ethan. You guys look great. Thanks. OMG, I heard what happened. You weren't going to mention being a superhero when I texted yesterday. I'm so glad you're safe. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Me too. Oh, my God. I love Ethan so much. Um, I don't even know what to say, Alex. My heart breaks for what you have to, what you have endured. No one should have to live through that. But just remember that Ethan and I are here for you. Thanks, Char. What you did wasn't easy. I won't forget it. Hustle and finish up. Some of us need sleep. Listen, okay? If y'all want to sleep, you can sleep. Here, listen. We got to get through this, though. Um, Dear Alex, you've been through an awful lot these past few weeks, but your resilience and courage continues to astound me. I have no doubt that you will weather this affront against your person with the same grace as you just demonstrated for me during our lovely dance at the Spring Festival. A moan I will not soon forget, so please remember that we're here for you. Sincerely, Ducky. I know, and I appreciate you sticking up for me, Ducky. Mac. Oh, fuck, Mac. Uh, ta -ta -ta -ta. Didn't think you'd actually take down Chyphon. You're braver than I ever imagined. Now you owe me a new job. I'm glad you're okay. Really. Thanks, Mac. Fuck. Okay. Alex, I'm sorry. My dad was a hero. That's what everyone said for years, and it took so many lies to hold that up. Disgusting, terrible lies. Typhon lied, dad lied, but worst of all, I lied to myself. Even when the th truth was right in front of my eyes. I believed him over you. I'm so sorry. And I hope one day you'll forgive me. We'll see. We'll, we'll see. Call me the minute you need anything. I know. Thank you for having my bad men so much. Of course. How could I not after everything? Okay. All right. Let's go talk to her. I think we're going to go on the road, guys. Am I about to play one more game? <laughs> I don't need sleep. I've gotten like three to four hours of sleep the past hey, few days. Steph. Alex, wait. Before you say anything, I have to get this out. Honestly, Sam, okay. I've barely gotten any sleep. What you did at the council meeting, it was the bravest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> I don't need sleep. I need answers. That's what I was thinking, too. So, here it goes. I want to be with you. I don't give a shit about playing music or seeing the world. I mean, I do, but only if it's with you. And if you'd rather stay here instead, then... <sighs> Fuck it. <laughs> I want to stay here, too. Uh, but I wanted to go out. But I, but I wanted to go with you. I've never had anyone barge in to tell me that they wanted to be with me before. Yeah? How'd it feel? <laughs> Steph, I love you too, says Struck. Struck, just so you know, she's a bunch of pixels. She's, um, she's actually, uh, um, zeros and ones. Just so you know. Just letting you know. I don't need to think about okay. shit. That was the idea. You know where to find me. Good luck, Chen. Thanks, Steph. We're immediately going to the record store. Immediately. Right now. I can't tell if Steph is asking to be your best friend or girlfriend. Um, it, I didn't think it was that difficult considering they had a kiss and, and she wanted to be with her. This is like when historians are like, oh yeah, these two women lived together and they were just like best friends. And like they had sex sometimes, but like they were just best friends. <laughs> it is a hundred percent girlfriend. It's can canonical that Alex is bi, I'm pretty sure. Or pan or whatever. In my defense, I wasn't there for the kiss. Fair enough. All right. Just tell me. What? My future. What to do? The night of the spring fest, Steph made a strong push for leaving with her. Playing on the road, the excitement of the unknown. Of course, that was before all the shit went down. <laughs> I really should go sleep. We got through everything important, but I can't. Girl, Come it's on. all good if you want to sleep. You're the know it all. It is all good. You can also watch the rest of the VOD so later me. if you want. We're two minutes, two hours, twenty-five Actually, minutes I in. Actually, I do know what you should do. You should stay in Haven. Really? 
You really think so? Of course. You finally have a home, a job, people who actually like you. VOD is insane. That's fair. Why would you give that up? Anagaf did get through the, all the VODs, apparently, while we were streaming on Ellie's stream, apparently. Like, so, I mean, if you want to, you can. But, like, and I do still recommend going back and seeing everything just to see more of the depth of the story and the world. And again, maybe leaving would be better. I'll check the rest out later. I really should sleep. Good night. Gurhok, thank you for being here. Young, have a great night. Suddenly have a little money, friends. And don't you think it's time to give this I appreciate all of the support tonight. It's very kind. definitely leave. Fuck off. <laughs> Stop it, Gabe. I don't need the mysterious spirit bullshit right now. I'm powering through. I have definitely not I nearly fell need... asleep. I just need my big brother. I love late night streams, but I'm also a night person. Sorry. I do, again, very much appreciate you guys being here, even though you're tired and all that. I'm glad you're enjoying streams so much. I'm loving this game. Here's something. Ooh. It's a bit of a slow descent. It's three hours from now. A bus pulls away. You're not on it. And neither is Steph. Life goes on. Or at two times speed, I forgot. You get a job working with Steph at the record store. My mouse sleep totally dropped. That's totally fair. I was honestly, we were up at like three or four. We were out, uh, Scrub and I. Last night, All so years of being a <laughs> I also got like no off. sleep. But I'm having so much fun that like I can't even sleep right now. I gotta get through the story, man. And little by little, time does its thing. I literally skipped two classes and showed up to the third one halfway through because of last night. Dude, I did not. I was fine. The apartment starts to feel less like a museum and more like a home. Okay, this part is actually so good. At first, I was like, we have to go on the road, but seeing the home become more like home feels like exactly what Alex needs right now. I don't know if she needs to go on the run again, like, you know, out with Steph. And if Steph's willing to be here, I think it's better to um, stay back. Genuinely. I'm all for the excitement, but seeing that, seeing her with Ethan as well, that just seems of Jed, amazing. Of Typhon. Even of me. Begin to fade into the background. Community run establishment. Interesting. I didn't know that those were things. Jed is gone. Dude, Jed's in jail. What do you mean Jed is gone? <laughs> he's like the culprit of everything. Yeah, he's gone as fuck. If I was Alex, I would have left this town. That's fair. I think I was originally of that mindset. But I really feel... I don't know. Community establishments are a thing in small towns. Fair enough. Yeah, I don't know. I, I like the idea of her being here with Ethan and... um, Like, this is so sweet. Ethan as her little brother, basically. You know. Steph as eventually her wife, I assume. It's just, it just seems, 
with Alex being who she is. The rooftop is your stage. You perform every week to a small but adoring group of fans. With Alex having been never having a stable place for maybe while you play years, you wonder what could have been for all her life, performing basically. for more people in more cities, sharing your music with the world. Or maybe you never think about that much at all. You don't know exactly when it happens, but one day you look around and find that you have transformed this place just as much as it has transformed you. I wonder if you get a different epilogue if you make a different choice. I think, I think you would. If it was me, I'd be doing the opposite, pushing people away. I get it. It's a, it's a tough situation, but I think for Alex, she'd be so much happier just staying here. And Steph's willing. And the know? most extraordinary thing of all is just how normal it feels. You don't question it. You don't doubt it. Or wonder what might have been. It's your life. The life you fought so hard to have. And for the first time in a long time, you just live. Or maybe we don't get a choice. Maybe Gabe is telling us how it's going to be. And he's right. Thank you. Don't mention it. You really think I'll transform Haven? Of course. You already have. With your gift, your music, just by being you. But Alex, that doesn't mean you have to stay. You have the potential to do that anywhere you go. Where am I supposed to go? I don't have any other home. That is true. But you didn't have any home before coming here. And look what happened. The truth is, there's no telling what that version of your future might be. Only midnight. Only, Only bloody midnight. It's not even that late. So? What do you think? Is this where it is? Yeah, there it is. Time to start my rough draft. Isn't that due at 10 tomorrow? Jesus, dude. Or today, I guess. Midnight, lo not late, are you're deprived. Dude, I, I'm going with Stay in Haven. You guys know my reasoning. I've been thinking about this entire cutscene. We're in college, this shit normal? No, I meant that you're starting at this early, man. You're, uh, you have, you have so long. You have 22 hours to get it done. And you're starting it now. I can't do epilogues. Like, I can't do endings. I, I didn't even finish BoJack Horseman the second time I watched it because um, I just didn't want to finish it. So like, I just have the last part of the last episode just sitting on my Netflix. I'm just fighting through to get through this because I want to get all the achievements and everything, but like, God, it's hard to just end it. After weeks of playing this game, ages, absolutely just so long. Man, I can't believe we're this close to the end after so long. I mean, chapter 4 was short. So short. Chapter 5 is also pretty short. A good hour and a half, I think, if I remember correctly. There it is. There it is, guys. That's the end. Oh man, oh my god, 
Look at that beautiful ending to it. Always, always with the beautiful cinema, cinematographic, cinem, cinematic endings. All right, I want to see if we can find some of the our lead animators and some of the senior animators. All the animators. One of these people showed up in my stream, which is crazy. Art director, lead character artist, Steven and Stefan. Interesting. Um, I want to see if we can find the... Um, I want to find the, the voice actors. Game designers, lead level designer. Interesting, interesting. So many people put so much effort into this game and it shows. Because as you guys saw, story was beautiful. It was it was just extraordinary. Um did I I didn't miss it, did I? I'm just gonna say a collective sigh of holy shit. Did I just catch the end? You did. Oh, casting director, casting associates. This is all oh, there's a cast. Okay. Erica Mori as Alex Chen. Um, Katie Ben says Steph. All right, where's Mr. Chen? I want to see Mr. Chen. Was it uh Jun Chen, who's Joseph S Stephen Yang? If that was him, holy shit, you did amazing. That was fucking your voice acting made this entire story. In my opinion, or at least this chapter, at, at least this chapter. Guys, um. 56, Alex stayed. I am in the majority. Oh, 70% Alex forgave Jed. As I said earlier, I did not expect that to be the case. 42% she claimed she learned the meaning of home here. 83% some members stood with Alex. Everyone could have supported Alex. I was saying, if I was... Uh, midnight is over. Do for me. Good night, y'all. Alright, good night, Strick. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it so much. Um... As always, you've always been such a um, great presence in my stream. There was a way to get everyone to support me. I assume if I did all the extra shit, the side quests, people would have liked me more. Whatever, it's fine. Um, Alex wanted to belong somewhere in the future. She wanted to belong somewhere. That's what she wanted. 64% um, she didn't sit on the bed. Whatever, don't care. 47% um, she didn't see Ryan after the vote. 31% he would have stood by her. And maybe we could have seen her. I don't know where I would have seen her, though. Um, 44% Charlotte sided with us. 52% they turned her back. Yeah, 70% of people forgave a murderer. Isn't that crazy? My existence in chat is chaotic, but it's great. It's nice that you're here. Who murdered for purely selfish reasons. That's what I'm saying, bro. I could not forgive her. Very 50-50 with um, Eleanor. Interesting. There is a way to get Pike to side with us. Maybe if I took away his fear. I didn't take away his fear. Okay. Um, I was in the minority with Ducky siding with us. Glad that I got Ducky on our side. Um, I think a lot of people might just not seen him be sad and taking care of him, and that's why. Um, majority, 69 for um, Ryan believing Jed. Okay, that sucks. So I guess, I mean, I'm in the majority. People knew. Um, Ryan and Alex don't get together. Um, and then Steph stays in Haven with me. Okay. We did it, guys. I mean, holy shit. Now, we're not done just yet. If you guys are sleepy, if you guys are tired, I totally get it. I appreciate you being here. It's been so kind of you for, um, spending all this time with me. Uh, as I've been saying all stream, We've kept a very good viewer count this entire stream. Normally, I don't check it, but because of the raid, I like to just keep an eye on it. And so many of you guys stayed here, and I think that's just so kind of you. And, like, I appreciate it so much. More than you can know. So if you want to go, please feel free. I appreciate all the time you spent here. Real quick, we're just going to get through these final um, collectibles. I got to go shower still. Bye. Thank you for being here, Anagaf. Have a great night. Um, new viewer who this. So we're just going to get through these collectibles real quick. Um, just so I can say I 100% of the game on stream with you guys right here. Uh, real quick, I got to, first of all, I gotta close 
I had my stream open twice because I had Ellie's stream open and he raided me. Let's go to True Achievements real quick. I'm just gonna search up how to get all these um how to get all these achievements done. So there's Proud Parent. There's In Front of God and Everybody. There is Emotional Archaeologist. You're a Hell Diver now. Um, emotional Unearthing and Haven Historian. Uh, some of these are gonna be. This one's find the CIT sticker, find the microphone. This one doesn't matter because we'll get it. And these two don't matter. Okay, we have three. We literally only have three collectibles left. I'm glad that I could watch you. I'll probably stay a tad longer. Thank you so much. Uh, Mr. Varman, thank you for being here. Have a great night. Thank you so much. Um, okay. During the festival scene, we have to find... Um, uh, the CIT sticker behind the flower shop. Okay, this would have been when I saw um, Riley, but I didn't end up seeing her. I, we did get this last stream, if you guys want to see. I don't know why I didn't uh, save, but we did get it. Oh, both of them are in here. Okay, this one's here, and this one is at the stage area where you find the drum kit. Walk around the back of the stage. Look at the small steps leading up to the red curtain. The microphone. Okay. All right. Okay, cool. I know where both of them are now. Um, update. My dog is still here watching with me. What's your dog's name? And gender and breed. Tell me all about your dog. Or sex, I guess. Not gender. I don't know. I think those g words get used um, very um, flip-floppy. In place of each other, even though they don't mean the same thing. But I guess for a dog, it would. I don't know. We are going to have to watch some cutscenes, which is why I told you, if you want to head out, totally get it. Feel free to head out, because we got to just get through some cutscenes real quick and, like, um, like, you know, just get through it. <laughs> it's just the last bit. It's just the, the shit that you got to do to 100% the game. Sadly, I can't skip it. I've tried in every si Wait. Okay, I can't. We've tried in every single um <laughs> every single stream to skip through test, these test. and we can't. Check. 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 Holy shit, you own a skirt? It's saying that to the whole hey, festival, guys. the whole crowd. I didn't even realize that she did that the first time. My dog is a male twelve year old. Sorry, hang on. Give me a second. All right, we're just gonna mute this for now. We're gonna play some music because obviously we've already seen this. We know what happens. Um, my dog is a male 12 year old Yorkshire Terrier named Elvis. Elvis is a great name. I agree with, uh, with Scrub. That's very sick. That's so cool. I'm very glad Elvis has been having fun. Um, yeah, it, it's so cool that he's just been watching your stream this entire time. Um, <laughs> Hey, hey, shout out to Elvis. Yo, tell Elvis, much appreciated for the love. Uh, if he has any Prime subs, just uh, tell him he can, uh, it's free money. It's just, <laughs> it's free money. It's literally free. Awesome, awesome. Okay, Um. now if we go around back, apparently... There it is. All right, let's turn off that. Let's get the music back or the game back on. Tell Elvis he a good boy. Do that too. All right, let's get this microphone. Hey, uh, hey, hello, everybody. Can I have your attention? Jed, what are you doing? I just wanted to take this opportunity to say right here in front of God and everyone that Annette Teresa Foster is... Just the most beautiful woman in the world. I can't stand this right they now. They say the Spring Festival is about telling folks how you feel. And Anne, I feel like I'd just about die if I couldn't make you my wife. It happened last year. I can't you stand that right now. You? Oh, this was the boyfriends. Okay, Hang so on. There's this young what are they up to? Thank you, Steph. Thanks for helping me find the fun again. Sounds like Ethan wasn't the only one inspired by the LARP today. That's so cute. Looks like plenty of people are still out around town. I do want to see a little no, bit about what's going on. It's not an emergency. Typhon is not normal. Trust me, I'm fine. 
I made a mistake. Uh, this poor back. guy. Get out while you can, dude. God, it's just I don't know, something about like seeing real world things happen, like Grand random people. Tomorrow. Let's see what you're feeling. Gotta pull my shit together for this grand opening. These people won't be so gracious for Oh, we in in one of the past chapters we saw him. We saw him buying that diner in one of the past episodes. That's actually really cool. Day drinkers. was a lot of fun. I still like her so much. What do I do? Sorry, man. Forbidden love is a bitch. I'm head over heels for this dork. Not really. What do I do? Wait, they're both into each other? Come on, people. That's something we saw earlier of both of them being into each other and like we were supposed to have a whole thing with it and then we just kind of didn't explore town whatsoever. Even now. Where is this? We know that there's something around here. I think it's... Where is it exactly? I actually didn't look closely. I just saw that it was somewhere here. Um... End up behind the flower shop. Is on the bottom right of the middle window. Wait, is someone standing out past the bridge of flowers? Pretty late for a bus ride. Listen, I'd love to do all that, but like, we missed it on the first go around, I've so. Never missed a spring festival before. Like, ever. Oh, honey, you'll catch the first few hours, and there will be other spring festivals. There's that. Actually, Nana, I might just wait at the bus stop. Avoid the parade of goodbyes. So here's the thing. I'd okay. love to go to the bus stop and talk to Riley, but we missed it the first go around. I feel like it'd be kind of cheaty. It just wouldn't, it wouldn't be in the core of the game to just go back and see what we missed just to like, just to see it. It's just not, now it doesn't feel like its own world then. It just feels like a mismatched like weird story right we fucked up we didn't talk to riley she left without us there's nothing we can do about that that's just how it goes um and it sucks because like obviously i'm sure we would have loved to see her off and or at least tell her about eleanor's condition or anything just so she could make her decision based on that but like yeah i just don't want to do that you know oh, okay the last one's here uh, you'll be back in your point and lying in bed once you get up and gain control. Um, okay. There's just a bomber jacket nearby. Alright, well, this is the last achievement after this. We're, we're, I mean, we're done. That's it. That's literally it. There's nothing else after this. Which is hard. Hard to deal with. It's, like, really sad. Because, um... I don't know. After literally weeks of playing this game, of learning about all these characters, going through all of their different emotions and problems and helping everybody, it'll just be done. Just like that. It doesn't feel like it should be over yet, right? There is Steph's story. There's a, there's a second part that I can do, but it's like DLC. I'd have to buy it. And at the moment, I'm not gonna. Um, maybe if you want, like, we can look, I can do some research and see if it's actually good. And over Thanksgiving, when we get sales and stuff, I can see if it goes on sale. Um, but yeah, man. I mean, other than that, it's, uh, it's about as done as it can be. And if not over Thanksgiving, maybe over Christmas. Um, at some point, hopefully, I'll get a chance to do the DLC. Because I also get to support the, you know, the devs and maybe, like, the animators and whoever. So, um... That's nice, you know. It's always nice to do that. Sucks that we never beat the high score. I'm, uh... You guys are all tired and I'm also tired, so I, I don't have the strength in me right now to beat that high score. But hey, we gave it our best shot, you know? We gave it the good old... The good old college try, or whatever they say. You ever swing a pick before, Mr... Chad. John. And no. But I... I'm a hard worker. 
And I learn fast. And I don't mind long hours. You don't have somebody waiting on you at home? No, sir. Well, John, guess you're a hell diver now. Here's what I'm realizing. Because of that one achievement that like or one one collectible that didn't mark as as gotten, we're gonna have to go back and do that one too real quick. Alright, so that was the bomber jacket. That's how um our dad got initiated into being a hell diver. Okay, so that wasn't the last achievement or last collectible. We gotta get one more, and then we're done. Okay, everything else is saved. Okay, this is good. This is like right at the beginning. Let's see which one it is. Let me see if I can find it real quick. If I just go through, it was, I believe, the third one. It's probably... Which one is it? I'll find it somewhere, right? I think it's the dollar. No, it's not the dollar. The appointment slip? Huh. It might actually be the dollar. We'll have to see. We might have to do a, like an actual decent amount of going just to get through this. Sucks I didn't save. I don't know why. Um... No, wait. Okay, no. Th actually, this one is um, really close to the, uh, to the start. I think I know what it is. I think it's also a bomber jacket. Man. You know what? For now, what we're gonna do... Uh, it doesn't matter what I say. Let's just... Uh, we can unmute this, but we're gonna... We're just gonna go full cam for now. Guys, while I wait for this to, to load through, while I wait for this to run through... Um, yeah, uh, th these games have like a lot of traumatic shit. Like literally the first chapter, um, it starts off super like super traumatic, super like it just ends with like the first chapter ends with Gabe's death. Obviously, we've been dealing with that all. Like it's not a spoiler. You guys know that's what what happened. But it's such a like I ended that stream so sad and just like so like how do I deal with this? Like how do I end this stream in a upbeat way? You know. Because it was just so difficult. It was like, I don't know what to do at that point, right? It looks like an amazing game. I'll have to watch the VODs. Thank you for the support. And yeah, it is an amazing game. I totally agree. Um, But yeah, so it's just like, I don't know. It's just something about this, like, this game is just not, these creators, all of, all of the games they make, they're not scared to shy away from the real life and what real life is. And obviously they have like their little mystical shit, they have their little, the games they play, they have their, their little humor. But they're not scared to like, delve into real shit when they need to. And I don't know, it's, it's just, it's good. I like it. It's um... It's just help, it's, it's like, it's helpful to help you realize how the world works a little bit, in my opinion. And it just opens you up to new, new signs of life new things you might have never seen like the foster care system which is if you spend time on social media you've definitely heard about the foster care system being shit but i mean you've definitely never seen it like you've just seen it in this game bar. and i think that's what's like just amazing about this game anyway i know the um these bird watching contests i'm pretty more. sure it's there is it that jacket right there yes it is it's a bomber jacket just like last time the hell am I gonna do with a jacket that says Hell Divers on the back? Jeez, I don't know, boss man. Maybe you could wear it, like the rest of us are gonna do. You think I want to broadcast my affiliation with you, Jokers, to the rest of the world? I got a reputation. Now we know about the Hell Divers. All right, well, that's literally that is literally all we can possibly do. Look at that, completely finished. Life is strange. True colors. Officially done. It's over. Thank you f so much for being here for all this time. Um, there's literally nothing else. There is literally nothing else. We physically cannot do anything else to do this other than Steph's story. Wavelength is only uh, is now available to play, purchase, or upgrade now to the... Dude, I don't know why I can't read. This is like a problem I have so many times for streams. I'm just looking at it on the side. Uh, it's not important. 
But um, play his stuff in the year before Alex came to Haven Springs. Spin Records host a radio show and face your future. Plus, get four new Alex outfits inspired by past Life of Strange Heroes. Interesting. It's 13 bucks. I don't know if that is... Because it just... I love Steph. I feel like the whole reason... Like, I think she was supposed to be the main love interest in this game, you know? I think they just kept Ryan as a, as a decoy. I think she was supposed to be the main one. I just don't know if I like the idea of playing without the em em empathy, you know? Is there any point to the game if there's not the core point point like part of the game like i don't know we'll see i'll think about it i'll, I'll do some more research and I, I won't make my judgments too quick if we don't end up playing this i will um look into other games for now i'm gonna unsolve life is strange just so i can feel accomplished that it's um that's gone but for now we're done we've done it everyone on youtube thank you so much for watching this has been a very long vod because we did two chapters but I love all of your support. Thank you so much. I'll see you in the next VOD.